If you haven't been watching my YouTube playthrough, don't worry because this is brand new. I'm so excited! <laughs> Welcome to Cyberpunk 2077! We are playing a fresh 2.0 playthrough, Street Kid Start, Melee Run. I don't know if I'm going to do very hard difficulty because I've just been told that Melee is really difficult. So, pfft. hi. Hi. Nin, I don't know why that didn't pop up, but thank you very much for the Prime sub. I really appreciate it. Welcome on in. Oh, there it is. Welcome. Thank you so, so much. Let's freaking go. Imagine why the same people die every day when you boot up. It's true. Let me just adjust my desk. Okay. This is wrong. The arms of my chair are in the wrong place. There we go. New game. Okay. So is it really difficult? If I, if I did very hard, would I die a lot? Would that be okay, though? Because I kind of want to throw some knives at some bitches. Can you change the difficulty at all, or is it sat? Like, if, it, <laughs> if I select this, am I just gonna... Gonna throw some knives at some bitches like a game, not IRL. The opening music is so good. So good. Right, okay. You can change it anytime. Let's freaking go then. Very hard. I ain't no bitch. <laughs> Barry. Will you? Thank you, TTS lady. Barry, thank you for the hype chat. All right, friends, we're going to play Street Kid. There, there's no question. TTS lady is a bit quiet. Most of the game is a bit loud. TTS lady is the same volume she's always been. I've just turned this up really loud. I'm so sorry. They say if you want to understand the streets, you got to live them. Gangs, fixers, dolls, small time pushers. You were raised by them all. Down here, the law of the jungle dictates the weak serve the strong. The only law in Night City you have yet to break. I played Corpo on my uh, YouTube playthrough. It made me feel like such an asshole. So, street kid. Body type, Des. Let's get into character. I'm gonna be here all freaking day. I just need you to know that. I'm gonna be here all day, right? We've got voice tone feminine. Maybe look at skin tone. I'm gonna start with the this start. You did Nomad first time. T did Nomad and he really liked it. Oh, you did Nomads this time. Oh no, they're hot. I feel like most, I think most people did Nomad first time. I did Street Kid whenever the game first came out. I'm Pale AF. Let's go Pale AF. This might be the stream. Melee is better as you get in, especially sword play, but early it's hard to close distance without dying. No mitigation and stealth isn't high enough to get close early, but it will be fun to watch. No, I feel like I shouldn't be on very hard difficulty. Hi, Duke, how are you? Um, All right, skin type. Let's see. That's kind of cute. I like that. Hairstyle. Whoops. <laughs> Hairstyle. It's the Solu. <laughs> okay. Um, I already know what hair I want. I thought the theme of this channel oops, was very hard. Look, I don't know what you mean. Do they have porcelain corpse? What are you trying to say? This is my, this was my corpo's hairstyle. Oh no, they're hot. <laughs> I already know what I want her hair. I tried to do, okay, so you see her like, her uh, cybernetics. I tried to do that uh, with makeup this morning. And let me just say, I did it with eyeliner and it did not work. I could not get the line thin enough. I really wanted to do it with like fake skin because I have some, but that would have taken so freaking long. But maybe, maybe we will try. I like that they have long hairstyles though. It's kind of great. When Corpor first time because corpse rule the world plus being a street samurai is in a suit with... Sh I mean, that's fair. I actually just realized I kind of need my dashboard to be open so that I can see uh, if ads are coming up or anything. <clears throat> that's uh, what's her face's hair, right? Let's see. I already know. I actually went with this hairstyle for a while on another playthrough that I did at the very beginning. I think I know what hair I want. That's what's her face's hairstyle. Misty? Was her name Misty? Some people have done ridiculously good EMP thread makeup, but I have no idea how they do it. It's really tricky. That's kind of actually cute. That's kind of cute. I like it. All right. 
Um, that's very Judy. I already know what I want. Space bonds! Sorry, that's not actually what I want, but it, it is cute. I want... I will see it. As soon as I see it, I know. I kind of wish you could click to, like, bring up the menu like you can with the colors. What's this one? This one. This is the one I want. This, this, this is the one I want. This is the hair I would have 100% in a cyberpunk universe. I would 100% have this hair. I've seen people do scars and lines in the face like that. So that's kind of interesting. I, so I wanted to do it with like fake skin and then like you gouge out the thing. That's super cool. Right. So I'm doing this and obviously, I mean, these are all like all these colors are really cool and all, but obviously we got to do purple. We got to do purple. Look. How cool is that? That's that's the look. Right, eyes. Let's go. Girl, you need to stand still. This was a problem that I had when I was creating my character for YouTube. I was like, bitch, stand still. Please, <laughs> for the love of God, stay still so that I can take your picture. I don't know what eyes I want. She's fidgeting. Thick skin. Yeah, like the stuff that you use for like pro like prosthetic makeup. Do you know what I mean? Where they do like uh scars and stuff. Make V stand still. Oh, that that is not surprising. That's quite nice. That's number 14. That's also nice. I like the fact that she's got like a slightly kind of like, you know, her eyes are lowered a little bit. That's kind of cool. So 15. I think I like 15 best. Oh, and 16. Okay, 15 and 16, I think, are the vibes so far. 19's pretty nice too. So is 20. Ooh. Okay. We're in danger. Okay. I think, I think 16. No, no, I don't think 16 anymore. 15. I think 15. Just like 14. You change the hair and they do a backflip or something. <laughs> do a barrel roll. I was gone for my chicken tendies and came back to fake skin. <laughs> yeah. Like for makeup. Eye color. Okay. What have we got? I do kind of like the vibe. But I also don't think my character would have those. I really love these. These like kind of super weird. I also like this or this. That's so cool. I think I will do, do I want to have purple eyes? No, I feel like having purple hair and purple eyes is maybe a bit much. So maybe we'll do like gray. I think gray is quite good. Actually on that note, no, okay. I was going to say, can you give them heterochromia? Liquid latex. Yes, that makes sense. You're so hungry. Get something to eat. I would definitely have. Oh, my God. Uh, heart eyes. <laughs> you can't really see them with how, like, lowered her, her upper lid is. I like. Actually, I think I would have these. I would be an edgelord. I would have these. <laughs> 100 percent. I think I like those. So we'll stick with that. Hi, Jakra. How are you? Good morning, McDuff. How's it going? Eyebrows. Right. These are important. I need to change the eyebrow color so I can see them better. Is this... Which one's darker? They're both kind of the same color. Um, Let's see. I'm going back to the beginning. So eyebrow number one. Pretty nice. Skull and crossbones, but the skull's eye sockets are shaped like hearts. Smart. <laughs> oh, shit. It's Cyber Metal Kiss. I like number one. Oh, the straight eyebrow is pretty good, too. We like a bushy eyebrow too. I think I'm I'm very tempted by one, to be honest. Or two. Yeah, no, fuck it. I don't have I have very curvy eyebrows, so let's go with that. Um, eyelash color. Um, that's very brown, I think. Yeah, black. Or you can have purple or pink. Or multicolored. I like the multicolored, but I think we'll go with like standard black eyelashes strong bias towards eyebrow options in games that have a scar me i do 100 percent. i love having um so i tend to have a scar on one eye for all of my characters i don't know why nose okay this is gonna be fun let's go i don't i have to be honest i'm not really invested i know there's a lot of people who have like a strong preference for like a strong nose i don't really have an opinion that's kind of cute. That's number four and number five. I think five is kind of closer to my nose. Except mine was broken at some point. And I have absolutely no idea when. 
no idea. That's kind of nice too. My character's gonna end up looking quite similar to my previous character. <laughs> That's okay. My last week was just the E3 2018 gameplay one. So what, like the default? I think I like... Uh, I think I liked whichever one that was that I said looked like mine. I've forgotten already. There's so many noses! Was it five? Or six? Five. I think it was five. One of my right eyebrow in real life from where I was hit by a flying rounders bat. Holy heck! I love rounders. Right, lips. Girl, sit still. I need to give her actually some makeup on her lips because I can't really see because she's so pale. <laughs> Hold on. Lip makeup. Give her... Yeah, matte lip. Give her a matte lip. We'll do that. Just for now. So I can see the shape of her lip better. I remember the 90s when every other guy had a shaved eyebrow bit. Scars through them just gives me flashbacks. <laughs> Similar to the default, but not quite the same hairstyle, but darker red and all the face options were number 22. Interesting. Stop grimacing. I kind of like number three. Number four is cute too. Uh, they're not too different. That's kind of nice. Yeah, 13's cute. Let's go with that before I end up changing my mind. Hi, Draggy. How are you? Jaw. Girl, stop it. <laughs> Why are you like this? Three's pretty good. I think I like three. Five's not bad, too. This is jaw. Ooh, no, seven. It's seven. Seven's the jaw. You're not a real mom. <laughs> Excellent scars on eyebrow and are called edgy. Oh, that's so silly. Right, ears. I don't really have a strong opinion on what ears should look like. I think those are kind of cute. We'll go with that. Cyberware. Okay, this is where it gets interesting. So number one is the, like, whatever the eye do dot is. I have a slight one in my left eyebrow due to being punched in the face while drunk. What? I have like the weirdest scars in random places and I have no idea where they came from. <clears throat> okay. I wish I had an explanation as to what the cyberware did. Do you know what I mean? Like, I think it'd be cool if you knew what the cyberware was for when you're selecting it. That's on the neck. That's definitely an eye related thing. And then there's no cyberware. I kind of want to have cyberware. I just don't know which one. All just fashion wear. Oh, you think? That would make sense, I guess. I kind of like this. It's fashion sweaty. Maybe we'll go subtle. Should we go subtle? EMP threading, which is just for aesthetics. Interesting, okay. Facial scars, right. We need an eyebrow scar. An eye slash eyebrow scar. Not that bad. Not like, not like, not like it cut her entire face open. I just want a little, I want a little like, oh, they don't have any. They don't have any eyebrow scars. How did I not know that? Facial tattoos. I don't know. Oh, the spider though. I was tempted to do some of these. Where is this one? Huh? Ooh, okay. Neck tattoos. Let's go. I like that. I wish it matched on both sides. That's cool. That's very cool. That's cute. I think I took that on my corpo playthrough. Born to kill. <laughs> I think I want to take the, um, this one. Yeah, let's go. Make them in the shape of the ca shape of the caffeine molecule. That would be cool. Hi, Elvira. How are you? All right, piercings. Okay, let's go. Um, I would like. I think. 
I like that, but I'd like to give her like a nose or a lip piercing on its own. Or with ears. So we have this. It's kind of cute. We were started. We started up here somewhere, I think, right? We started near here. That's just ears. 11 is just ears. 12 is just ears. 13 is one ear. 14 is the other ear. Okay. I think we'll go with... Did I do this one last time as well? I don't care. I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> yeah, I think maybe there's probably going to be a mod for that. There's probably already mods for it, Osric, but... Hey, Rosa, I love you. All right. Piercing's color. Uh, what does the black look like? Yeah, let's do that. Wait, you can have... Is that like a... It's like... It looks tiger printy, but I don't think it is. I think we'll go with that. Give us teeth customization in this, but didn't include vampires. That does seem kind of like, uh, teeth. <laughs> the DLC is going to be our, I don't know what you mean. I got pink teeth. Right. I'll just have regular old teeth. Right. Eye makeup. Let's heck and go. I like that look a lot. Let's see. No piercings because street kid, street kid brawler. Um, I don't think my character is that smart. I kind of like this one. Not going to lie. The makeup is so good. I really like the eye makeup options. I also really like the hair options, to be fair. Let's see. I mean, we could just go standard eyeliner. I do like that one a lot, but I think I used that for my corpo. So I'm going to go with standard eyeliner. Can we have a different color? Do we want a different? You can have like, ooh, wait, hang on a second. It has a different color. That's kind of neat. That's kind of neat. So it's like, it's like a black eyeliner with uh, a look. Can't rip out your piercings if you never get hit. There you go. <laughs> Hi, Mechatonix. How are you? Hi, Focus. Pink teeth like you've been drinking Pepto-Bismol. <laughs> no, can you imagine? I kind of like that, but now I'm almost tempted to go for something more plain. Like... Oh, where was the other one? Yeah, it's an eyeliner and shadow combo. I don't know. I like this too. And I really like this very much. Hi, Robbie! Did you know Robbie is also a part of the supporter streamer uh, cyberpunk campaign? So if you want uh, a sniper rifle and you've decided that you don't want to give me money. <laughs> the smudgy one's really cool. I think I want this one. Makeup style. So lip makeup style. I'm not sure about it yet. I think I want matte and I kind of want it to be black. Ooh. Oh, hang on. There's so many options for lip. Oh, I love it. That's cool. I mean, we're obviously just going to go for the... I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry, but we are obviously going to go for the matte lipstick. That's happening. The fade is super cool. Um, yeah, no, I'm, this is it. This is her look. Cheek makeup. Oh, this is her freckles. Okay, I was wondering about her freckles. I want her to have freckles, but I kind of wanted them to be like mine. Mine are more like this, but they're a lot more like pale. Yeah, mine are more like that. Your coffee might have been a bit too strong. I thought you were going to say support a slut program. <laughs> Imagine. Okay, so blemishes is just like sort of facial moles. Um, nails. Okay, so I'm going to say controversial. I'm going to say short nails. Because I think for street brawler, for that purpose... I would really need to have shorter nails. Also, 
It'll help Judy later. <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know. Oh, the nails are cute, though. You can have fire. You can have shiny. You can have checker marks. You can have chipped nails, but we're just going to go with the basic bitch. Oh, she going to be rom romance and Judy. It's okay. It's okay. Body tattoos. Go on, then. What you got? Wow. <clears throat> I have turned nudity off, by the way, because um, I didn't really feel like having uh, an existential crisis when there were boobs on the screen. Where I felt that's really nice. I really like that. But does it match? Not really. Uh, but I really like it. Oh, do I do it? I kind of like this. But then I feel like, whoops, I kind of feel like if I'm going to do that, I should do the one that matches the flowers because it was a neck tattoo that matched the flowers. Boobs. <laughs> Have my stiletto nails reworked into coffins so I don't scratch my new tattoo. It's on Wednesday. Yay, Rosa, that's so exciting. What are you getting done? <laughs> no, Oro. <laughs> Let my warrior women wear heels, but a sapphic woman with long nails? Impossible. Impossible. Right, where's the neck tattoo that looks... There's a neck tattoo that matches... It's a secret. Exciting. I really want more tattoos. <laughs> Body tattoo. Where's face tattoos? It's up here. There was one that matched, right? Where is it? I really love that one. That one. Doesn't it kind of match? Don't you think? Let's go back down to body tattoo. It kind of matches with the like the flowers and stuff. I think we kind of got to. I love character creation streams. I swear we're not going to be here forever. I promise. I actually don't think I'm going to have uh, body scars. Now I have the problem. Oh, now I have a big problem. All right, let's just double check I'm okay with her face before. Like I am. I think I'm okay with her face. I think I think I like this. I want a week of this, please. <laughs> now I have to figure out. Whoops. Oh, that's cute, though. That's a cute hairstyle. But I like this one. I like being here forever. It's warm and cozy. I do too, to be fair. You raised your chair's height and you're too weak to push it back down again. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, next. I have no idea what stats I need. So let's read them right there above my head. I'm so sorry. Um, body is... Um, oh, wait, hang on. Here we go. Body determines your raw physical power and fortitude. Progressing it improves your proficiency with shotguns, light machine guns, and blunt weapons. I don't care about that. I'm doing fucking swords. <laughs> it also enables you to open some doors by force, rip off turrets, and use intimidating or solo trained dialogue choices. Plus two max health per attribute point. Robbie's gone full nerd. For melee, I think it's reflexes. Um... So intelligence determines your net running abilities. So apparently they put pistols and snipers in the cool tree now, Osric. I waited to assign my skills. I stats until I was in game so I could peek at the skill trees. Oh, that's smart. I didn't know you could do that. Um, intelligence determines your net running abilities. Progressing it improves your proficiency with smart weapons and allows you to unleash your full potential as a net runner. It also enables you to access local subnets. <laughs> when I made my character for uh, YouTube, I, I did not have nudity turned off. <laughs> my character was just sitting there with her baps out. <laughs> and I was like, I'm just going to turn her around <laughs> so that she's not staring at me. <laughs> um, it also enables you to access local subnets and show off your knowledge of, on, of the net in dialogues. Plus one max RAM per four attribute points. Yes, Machete. Uh, reflexes. Reflexes determine your maneuverability and ability to evade enemy attacks. Progressing this, this attribute improves your proficiency with assault rifles, submachine guns, and blades, and enables you to use advanced movements. It also enables you to make quick observant remarks and dialogue. 0.5% crit chance per attribute point. Unless I've changed it for 2.0, the perks relating to throwing knives are under cool. I believe that is true. I think I'm going to have reflexes and cool. Can you download more RAM? Pretty much best character creation video ever. I was like, I'm just, I'm just going to rotate her. 
<laughs> technical ability it determines your techie know-how progressing it improves your proficiency with explosives and tech weapons and allows you to be compatible with high-end cyberware it also allows you to bypass some locks override devices and exhibit tech savvy knowledge and dialogues plus two armor per attribute point okay and then cool determines your assassination skills and stealth we want this and reflexes because i want to be stealthy and i want to have blades all the things i don't have how dare you flowered <laughs> um you know about it but about gear upgrade changes um i don't think it's really a spoiler for like how the upgrades work i know they're super different um progressing it improves your proficiency with precision rifles sniper rifles handguns and throwable weapons it also enables you to use advanced stealthy perk abilities and subtle or street smart dialogue choices plus 1.25 percent critical damage so she's going to be cool and high reflexes and i think everything else is going to be a bit lower you only get major stat upgrades with cyber i did see that point system is based on cyberpunk tabletop rule set that makes sense i am punching really really hard a true goku build i love it Stealthy blades, boobs. We're <laughs> a techno elf. <laughs> right, I'm going to put some points into cool. I'm going to put some points into reflexes. And I think I might put a point into intelligence for hacking. Because I'm going to do a bit of hacking. But, like, maybe not necessarily as much, if you know what I mean. Okay, let's go. So begins your story in Night City. Summary, V. Difficulty, very hard. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> Street kid, three body, four intelligence, six reflexes, three technical ability, and six cool. All right. Stop. <laughs> Let's hack and go. Confirm. All right. Here we go. Very hard. I'm probably going to die. <laughs> a lot <laughs> but it's okay because then i can i can always do the thing i'm gonna turn off alerts so that um I'll, I'll mute alerts how do i do that oh i can't really do that anymore so i'm just turning off alerts for now speed run to death y'all <laughs> let's go i oh, look it's my hand it looks like i just punched somebody in the face let's go a little <laughs> hold on that was a while ago oh hey look it's me that was 2020 if you're looking for the drops it's exclamation mark drops and exclamation mark sniper for sniper rifle. i did crash set my broken nose or yeah knock back a shot let's go my outfit is ugly set my broken nose <laughs> Everything chill, hermana? Yeah. Some All good. bastard tried to mug me. I handled it. I love these oh, boys. Local guy. You really think somebody local tried to mug me, Pepe? Yeah, Pepe. Listen, V. I got a problem. I'm serious this time. Got trouble? Found yourself in a hole, sounds like. I need help. Ah, no, I could count on you. It's a uh, cork. I owe him. Don't pay by tomorrow, said he'd bust my legs. I'll bust his first. He don't joke about that stuff. Got cartels in his corner. Prince like a bowl of Cheerios. Kirk? Every man, woman, and rat in Haywood knows he's a fucking shark. What were you thinking? My bro jumped the joint, deserved the hero's welcome. I know I fuck up, V. You ever gonna learn? Uh, you ever gonna get yeah, wise, Betty? Agreed. Please tell me your brother's doing all right. Uh, doing his thing, you know. So, can you help? I guess I will. I'll talk to him. I zippy, what's I'll up? I'll talk to Kirk, but then you're going to owe me one. Zolidaire, I do not know why they have worded it so poorly, but yeah, you have to gift two subs. I, for some reason on the drops page, it says that you have to sub for the first time, but I do not believe that that is true. Their FAQ on their website says you have to gift two subs. First time in Night City, pay close attention to the tutorials and learn more about the basic mechanics of the game. Or if you're already an experienced edge runner, feel free to disable hints. I'm not disabling hints in case there's a difference because I don't know. Because stuff might have changed, you know? 
He's so good. Boy. You're saving my life, Fee. Yeah, you got it. Demons walk with him. They tear at his soul. Hey, it's Mama Wells. You're sorry. Is that Mama Wells? Prologue, baby. Let's go. Um, I think it's just two subs. I don't think it has to be to the community. I think it's just gift two subs. So you could gift to specific people, as far as I understand. Hey, Kirk. Oh, he looks like a scumbag. Hey, Kirk. <laughs> Wanna talk? V. Been a while? Look at the way he's sitting. Spin it. What you need? Pepe asked me to talk you up. All right. What, he Jeez. just shot a hand Aggressive. over the Yeti's self? Uh, tell him I don't bite. Not yet. Hell's your problem. Mm. Grump. What's he owe you? Afraid that's client confidentiality. What's in his sandwich? Call it a lot and leave it at it's that. A burger. A cred shark with business ethics. Sounds too good to be true. Well, Merry fucking Christmas. Cut him some slack, will ya? He'll pay. Just needs some more time. Do I look like a priest that runs a charity to you? Wow. You borrow Eddie's, you gotta pay him back. With interest. It's common fucking knowledge. Dickhead. You suggesting I let a flaky cunt who can't keep a deal off the hook? No. You let him off because it's me asking. Huh. <laughs> you know me. I'm a man of the bids. So I need to know what I get out of it. Solidaire, thank you for gifting two subs. And ducks, welcome back and a happy new year. <laughs> Merry fucking Christmas and a happy new year. Welcome back. <laughs> kind of in a rush. Sorry. Here. You avoid trouble? You know what, Kirk? I sometimes get the impression you forget you aren't from around here. Pop into Haywood for the occasional visit, sure. But you live far, far away in Pacifica. What are you getting at? Getting at? You probably need to think before you start something with a local son. Hmm. I'm open to other options. He has to keep his private parts. What? Oh. What this? What's this? Grab a look. I love these. Take scream sheet. Mm-hmm. Cream ride there on the page. Fancy. Only four of them in NC as of now. One, Rayfield Regional Director. Two, Mayor Ryan. Three, a rental service. Uh-huh. And four? Number four will belong to my client, just as soon as you clep it for me, that is. Okay. I do this and the debt's paid? I do this and Pepe's I think the square. conversation options have changed a bit. Of course. I'm a man of my word. The way they're laid out. Uh-huh. Whole thing simple. You swipe the Rayfield for me, I clear Pepe's account. Even toss in a cut for you, I'm such a nice guy. My man Rick works a parking structure by Embers, club where our Rayfield driver likes to kick it. There every Friday night, like clockwork. As soon I as you glasses. appear, security cam shut down, gate swings up, the road is yours. Just gotta grab the Rayfield and roll out. Simple. For you, Zolidaire, um, it should come in your Twitch inbox as a code that you have to use in the redeem page. If you type exclamation mark sniper, it has the link to the redemption. Who's the owner? Just an Arasaka suit from across the water. Spews cash out of every hole in his body. I and know, right, Osric? How would I know? Why would I care? It's a hot item and I know where to find it. Honestly, shit, Vlad. Plant sounds shaky as fuck. <laughs> oh, That's foretold. So. <laughs> sounds like you're looking for a sucker. This ain't no setup, V. Heard you got a good head. Maybe we help each other make a few eddies. And your man, Rick? Trust him like my own brother. Okay. How am I supposed to do this? Expect me to slide under the chassis on a skateboard for a quick hot wire? Sounds cool, Fast to be fair. <laughs> Kirk, wheels like this got security systems. Good ones. Yeah, I agree, Machete. This bitty bop works bitty like bop. key Rayfield techs used for repairs. I love a bitty bop. Opens locks, bypasses identity authorization. A skeleton key for all Rayfields in the city. Oh, come on, Kirk. Even you don't buy that. <laughs> Kabuki's tech wizards sell more magical shit than this under the counter. I have any... a little faith. How are you? So, we all agreed then. All right. You better keep your words. Best keep your word, Kirk. Easy, V. 
job's gonna pad your wallet too, you know? Uh huh. To Ember's in the Glen. Rick's in the garage. Be waiting for you. Okay. You two will hit it off. Whatever, dude. Good luck out there. We'll be in touch. I want your burger. It's a shame this game launched in like December because it feels like such a summery music. All right, out right, we go. Oh, that's awesome, Vinny. All right, to access photo mode. Yeah, I know. Go to Embers. Okay. I don't have any money, I don't think. Hi. Talk to Padre. Well, who do we have here? Hi. We? Long time. Didn't know you were around. <laughs> You're not going to throw me in the trunk, right? Yep, no but the other like person? <laughs> Sebastian Ibarra. Haven't changed a smidge. Probably no sent me. No calls me by my name anymore. Almost forgotten how it sounds. How are things, Padre? The same. Haywood. Nothing ever changes here. I'd rather hear about you. Starting knowing Padre makes Street Kid goaded. Got back from Atlanta a few weeks ago. See, you got a good down home welcome. Uh huh. How was it back east? Broken nose. <laughs> Tell you later. Got something on my plate. The VIP. You me in now? Oh, okay. We'll give you a ride. Uh, okay. Marcus, let's go. All right, get in Padre's car. Okay. Oh, thanks. That's kind. Do -do -do -do. So where to? The Glen. Drop me off at Embers. Front door? Take the ramp back of the bar. Show you where to stop. You heard her, Marcus. Yeah, Marcus. We just started, Vinny. Just, just, just. Your return to NC has been good. Busy already? Two years gone by. Not much has changed. You know how you would. It has strong <laughs> roots. Ever watered by the But you got the blood. code, right? Now, tell me about you. I'll pick up something here and there. Nothing major. But I'm getting by. Appreciate the concern. So, Atlanta didn't turn out like you expected, huh? No, it didn't. As you can see, I'm back. If it had been better there, wouldn't have left. Maybe it'll all work out for the best. You can commit so many crimes, Vinny. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. Shit. Oh, shit. Hi. Well, all right then. <laughs> Stop the car. What's going on? Business. You carrying? Am I? Am I gonna die because I put this on very hard difficulty? <laughs> uh. Sebastian Ibarra. Hey, what's up? Looks like it's my lucky day. What do you want? To settle our biz once and for all. That's just how they say Got hello. Got an offer for you, <laughs> Patty. Rude. So listen up. You did not Let's just call him Patty. Get the fuck out of Vista. Pull your boys off the street. I'll give you the Glen. Done deal. No more restless nights. See how generous I can be. Well, Patty. One more fucking word. <laughs> Stay out of this. I don't know you. And I don't know you. Which means you're worth shit around here and capable of even less. Well... Anything else? <laughs> it seems our conversation is too close. <laughs> Careful, Padre. Never know who's got a barrel at your six. You neither, shit bucket. You just call me shit bucket. Marcus, please. Oh, I'm gonna mess him up. I'm gonna mess him up. <laughs> Something people said on my YouTube playthrough was you don't always have to take the timed options, but I can't help I'm myself. I'm pleased to see you have not forgotten your roots. <laughs> Let him have that one. <laughs> so many of the little shits left around here. Their spines go soft when they look down a barrel. <laughs> Hi, Alex. How are you? Who is that? Shit no bucket. No one important. He'll be gone in a week's time. Another will come in his place. He pulled iron on you. He did. And he will pay for doing so. <laughs> I'm joking. 
The music is oddly chill vibes. It's like not taking an interrupt in Mass Effect, right? Right here. I'll just drop down below. Timed options make me stressed. Here, before you go. Your number? Could be useful. Okay, thanks. Maybe we can also work together again. Take Good to know they still use business years. cards. Thanks, Padre. Gotta go. Bye. So go with God. Alright, cool. What? <laughs> really? <laughs> Girl, do you know how to use streets? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> I hear the news station is pretty chill. I'm excited to listen to it. I'm excited. All right, take the elevator to the... Where are the... F My people need me. <laughs> All right, let's go. Are we going this way? This looks about right. Okay. Incoming call from Kirk Sawyer. Oh. Status. On location. Kirk. About to find your man. Rick's one of the good guys, you'll see. I trust him like a brother. Yeah, so you said. So you said. Stairs are for losers. <laughs> of course I had to take it. And damn it was explosive. Nice. Something I can help you with. Hi. Find Rick optional. Hello. You Rick? You Rick? Yep. You with Kirk? Yep. Camera's blind. Hell yeah, Mecca. You got 20 minutes. Oh, thanks. Camera's blind. You got 20 minutes. Okay, find the ray fields. That looks like it there. I see the ride. Your moment to shine, kiddo. Good luck. Disable the lock using Kirk's device. Okay, hack the lock. Give it a shot. Let's take this piece of wonder tech for a whirl. You're a woman of little faith. Get in the car. Uh oh. This does not now feel like it's going to go. Call me when you're underway. <laughs> Tell you where to go. Okay. Nice. Fancy ride. Looks like this will be a cool breeze. Oh, thanks, Adam Flair. How you doing? What's going in? Action blocked. Oh, I think that just means. Get the what fuck the out. Get Got it. the fuck <laughs> out. Fuck you, Jackie. <laughs> Drive. Now out. What are you That's doing? That's why we meet Jackie. Your <laughs> Don't move. Uh -oh. You're under arrest. Stay where you are. Hands where I can see him. Nice and slow. On the ground, motherfuckers, now. Uh oh. Hey, Jackie. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Jackie Wells, my old pal from the hood. See you haven't grown an ounce wide. Hey! Detective what Stitch. an explosive entry Been to the while, game. Huh? Inspector Stitch. Same shit. Speaking of... We were of, so close. Your mug's familiar too. Is it? What do you know? We're talking to Pig. It out. I'm waiting. Pig that chatters. <laughs> Left for Atlanta, looking for a slice of happiness. Guess you didn't find it. I've always maintained it's the same for all you termites in Haywood. Born here, live here, die here. Uh huh. Looks like I was right. You don't know anything about me. You know fuck all about me. Amatory. Truth hurts, huh? Just watch your tone. I'm not a patient man. Come on, Stance. Give us a break, huh? You lock us up, I just jerk off till trial. And then what? Worst case, we get some months. Hell, standing room only nowadays in El Bote. So, they'll probably be out early. This guy. Are these the thieves? Fuck, oh, dear. street trash. Wow. Got him in custody, Mr. Fujioka. We'll be Rude. taking him now. It's a waste of effort. I have no time to testify or play it on an investigation. Suggesting we let him go, sir? I suggest you toss them in the sea. In the sea? Cuff legs broken so this trash doesn't flow. <laughs> so does. Uh, well. You heard him. <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Well, shit. 
I what? Motherfucker. Ugh. The fuck? Man, I just sat that nose. Honestly, for a sec there, things looked iffy. I wasn't Pants. sure we'd worm out of that alive. Stints wouldn't do that. Stints wouldn't do us like oh, that. Oh, so we're friends with him? Sure about that. <laughs> what? Uh-huh. He's Haywood born, bred, and grown like us. Oh! He suits as much as you okay. do. Did what he had to do. That's it. Okay. If I hadn't come, you'd be cruising Night City in sexy wheels right now. Yeah. It would have worked anyway. Yeah. No. Come Wouldn't on. have worked. Job was toxic from the start. Even Kabuki under the counter magic can't get around an alarm like that. Should have known I'd have the PD on my ass. That look. So maybe now, as God ordained. As foretold. Jackie Wells. Ad is starting soon, by the way, friends. I cannot say that. I know it. you. You hang at the Coyote. I do. Wells, name's familiar. I saw your mom earlier. Wait, Wells? <laughs> like Mama Wells? Thought I recognized the name. She's my blood, all right. Coyote's her dive. It's strange you and I never met before. It is. We did, though, in a different life. <laughs> Got the job to steal those wheels, said the Coyote. From Kirk. You work with that sewer slug? No. Pepe owes him big and can't afford to pay, so I stepped up. Man, gotta wonder about Pepe letting slimy Kirk boss him around like that. I feel like Kirk it looks prettier. Say. He's backed by cartels. Cartels? No, no, listen. I know those cartel types, and I guarantee you, none of them have even heard of Kirk. El cabron's gotta learn. He don't do people in Haywood dirty. I like Come Jackie. On. Let's go have some lunch. Just like that? You put a barrel to my skull not so long ago. Hey. You help my homies. You're okay in my book. No harm, no foul. None at all. Okay. Getting one of my good feelings. One of his good feelings. About what? About us. Since the kind of chemistry, you know? Come on. I'm fucking starved. Okay, let's go. Okay, food it is. Let's go. I love Jack. Hello there, Night City! Let's go! Intro sequence! Stanley here with you, <laughs> and we got another day ahead of us in this city! I love him so much! Oh, I love this town! I love like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her! I like new the interesting means a hundred new arrivals, but only half these gongs will survive a year, and that's if it's a good one. And Noodle why time. Do these peeps come to NC? Well, I miss the street samurai like Morgan, Black Hand, and Waylon Boa Boa. The greater the risk, <gasps> the bigger the party. Oh, it should have been. So they say that you can only be a major league player for so long. The Vic. faster you live, the faster you burn out. Well, <laughs> how many times have I got to have my nose broken? I swear to God. On a tooth! <laughs> Guy Richie simulator. You AC's legends. Know where you'll find most of them? It's supposed to be an intro sequence to show you what your relationship with Jackie becomes. <laughs> matters not where you're from. Matters not where you start. What matters here? Look at me, city. I'm so cute. The city of dreams. City of dreams. Chick we're looking for somewhere in this building. Okay. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Quite, Vinny. Eyes this is six months right. later. Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. I do not need to do that, I don't you need think. to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? I don't think I need it. Militech. Jack, we're talking classified military grade tech here. How did you get it? <laughs> Lose so many guns with throwing as a mechanic. <laughs> and our girl made a couple adjustments. Why? Thinks she knows better? Nah. Said it didn't suit her uh, style. <laughs> You'll see what I I'm mean. I'm all right. I think I'm good. Not now, Jack. No time. Maybe later. Sure. Sure. Manana. Manana. 
Fixer gave you any tips? Will Kako give you any tips and tricks for the job? I'm not your mother. Just do what I pay you for. It's easy work. Sha. <laughs> Let's do this. All right, cool. I'm not sure how we, uh, how I get how we got to this point. That's what the whole intro sequence is supposed to show you is you and Jackie bonding over time without you having way. to play through it. And then six months later, you go on a job together. All right, let's go. It's to save you having the exposition of kind of learning the whole process. Right, so I'm a little concerned. I think I threw up in my intro. I lost a tooth! <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this because I'm on extra hard difficulty. I don't know if I want to do this on hard. <laughs> Targets Sandra Dorset. Targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Hello. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. I like T Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. Bug, could at least try to be nice. You want nice, supportive? <laughs> Call a damn helpline. I like T Bug. Yeah, I believe that the first job is the same. It's just how you do the like intro sequence is different. Alright, we need to be careful. Looking for 1237. Okay. Target should be inside, but I got zero eyes on her biomom. Hey. Fingers I crossed that. it's not too late. Oh, I hate this life or death you? shit. Hurry. Go back inside. She looks different. Try hacking the door. Think you can trip it on your own, V? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> okay. Can I? Yes, I can. I need to crouch. Yeah, it's just a cutscene. It's not something you can play through. All right. This is where the game starts. You can skip it. I will take food. Mr. Whitney Mint. P. Look, give me time. I'm, movie. Yeah, give me a second. I'm looting. I'm just stealing the entirely normal cargo so well. So well. And yeah, Zolidar, I apologize for the ads. We run ads manually every hour, specifically to turn off pre-rolls so that uh, when a person comes into the channel for the first time, they don't get hit with pre-rolls. Fresh meat from your favorite supplier to Gump. We won't forget, you're a dead man walking. From Victor to Blaze, you're fucked. If any of your lackeys shop here again, they're in for worse than a split jaw. That's not an empty threat. Try me, motherfuckers. Yeah, 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 I'm coming. Jesus Christ, calm yourself. Sure, machete. Uh, are we fucking late? Is that her? No. Is that our target, V? Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fig. Not our lucky Oops. girl. Shit. Let's keep looking. <laughs> Machete. <laughs> Literally what you just said. If you plan on sneaking a lot, I highly recommend changing the key binding. I know. I really hate that. I actually completely forgot. Thank you. Um, I keep accidentally s skipping things. Um, key binding for... Can you change the one for um, skip dialogue to something else? Where is it? Uh, general... Skip dialogue. What should I change it to? Actually, yeah, maybe... Uh, so control is crouch, but like it's hold crouch, right? Shift seat, you think? I could I could put um, skip on a button you're not going to hit by accident. It warns you whenever you have like an overlap, right? Uh, I don't know, like L. No, L's the log, right? Uh, what is L? Yeah, I know L is something else. What is L? Is this something else? Unbind it, you can't skip dialogue for RP purposes. I mean, I'm fine with that. Backspace? Yeah, maybe backspace. Can't be backspace. I don't have a numlock button. <laughs> Oi! He just jumped down and landed on the power button for my bat light. <sighs> Is L anything? I don't see it listed. 
Does the star just mean that you changed it to something? I don't have any F keys. <laughs> I suppose that's not the worst thing in the world. Some actions have no key bindings. What actions have no key bindings? There are no actions that have no key bindings. Oh, crouch toggle. C. And skip dialogue is F12. Okay. There we go. How much do I have any F keys? I have a baby keyboard! No Fs to give. Got it. All right. Okay. Can I scan anything else? Critical cyberware missing. Flatline. Okay. Oh, hey. You be quiet. Read. How did it happen? When and why did we as a society decide that human life is a commodity, a luxury? My mother passed away at 45. She still had decades of life to live until it was all stolen from her by common pneumonia. If she had held even the cheapest trauma team policy, she could have been cured within an hour, but she couldn't afford it. My mother died five months before her scheduled appointment with our family practitioner. The idea of privatized healthcare is deeply ingrained in our public psyche. It's me! It's ingrained in me! <laughs> Already in 2020, there was widespread consensus that 500 euro dollars a month was a fair price for trauma team insurance. Health wasn't something you were given, it was something you earned. The private system may not be perfect, but there's no alternative, we thought. Bullshit. Now I cross the Pacific Ocean to the USSR, where they also have highly trained medical technicians, high precision nanosurgical suites, specialized antibodies, intravenous probes, the list goes on. Emergency airlifts using modern AVs equipped with cryotonic chambers. They have those too. The difference then? They don't leave their people to die on the streets at the store in their homes. They don't force anyone to purchase their lives from a corporation as if they're the ones who own it. Public healthcare isn't some unachievable utopia. It is a reality. Trauma Team, on the other hand, treats its policyholders as both potential patients to be treated and potential products to be bought. They save lives only because there's profit in it. A saved life is a returning customer. Client death can also bring in fiscal gains in the form of organ and implant resale, though of course it's in regulated smaller sums. An emergency care provider can't afford to give its managers reasons to deliberately kill off its clientele base for short-term windfalls. Surely, you ask, these medical professionals are also guided by their Hippocratic oaths. Please. I could have a big boy keyboard, but I quite like my little boy keyboard. Welcome home, Sulu. They really did stares at camera in American. They really did reduce the amount of random loot. I thought, but now I hid. Oh, I'm gonna get messed up. All right. I'm gonna drop him quiet. I'm gonna drop him quiet. I'm gonna drop him quiet. Watch it. Kill and hide the body. Did they take away non-lethal? Thanks. I could have done that better myself. All right. Anything else in here? <laughs> so loose. Surgical scissors, medical forceps, and medical gauze. I have no idea if those are useful for anything, but I'm picking them up anyway. Cyberware usage and its side effects. Right, I'm not going to read all these because as amazing as they are, I read them on my YouTube playthrough and I probably bothered people a lot by reading through everything I find. Organs! Bestie, we got to find some organs. Nobody in that bathtub. Oh, shit. Jackie, what the Find fuck are you toes. doing? <laughs> More bodies incoming. They're almost on you. He's so far ahead. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Can I come Don't over to you? They're coming. Wait, I'm coming. Wait for your chance. Pick the prick off. Hide. We hiding. All right, I'm going to quick save because I do this. feel... Thickest locus. Let's wait and plant a spray. Can I... Take one down. Oh, okay. Kill him! Did you get him? Okay, he got him. <laughs> oh, he didn't kill his! I killed mine! Whoopsie! <laughs> okay. Take. Yeah. Okay. A katana! Give me a katana. Just a little oopsie, don't worry about it. <laughs> a purple katana! <laughs> Oh, well, it's kind of pink. Better finish him off then. Sure would be a shame if I decided to go full melee, hey? Wouldn't it, wouldn't it, wouldn't it? Right, what have we got? Right, we have that guy. 
overheat reboot optics short circuit. Oh, so I don't have ping. How many are there in there? Like. There's one over there. What if I grab this guy? Do you think he, anyone would notice? Oh, sure would be a shame if he died. Oopsie! <laughs> Whoa, he died halfway in the wall. Can I loot him? Hold on, L lift body. We carry him over here. Uh, and drop him unceremoniously on the floor. I have a question. Is there a way for me to increase the brightness? Because it's very dark. It's very dark. Uh, graphics. Fluffy! Four score and zero months ago, I found amazing community surrounding a purple heritage. Ah! I appreciate you, Fluffy. Thank you for the tier two resub. Happy 40 months. Welcome back. What well, happened to Dave? You always get ping. Oh, gotcha. Hi, Aramar, by the way. Gamma, where is it? Is it in graphics or video? Video. I don't see anything here. Oh, gamma correction. Haha. -ha. Oh. Oh, okay. I was going the wrong way. It says until the lap, the image on the left is barely visible. It wasn't visible at all. <laughs> it wasn't visible at all. All right. Okay. 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 This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Oh, that guy's moving. All right, so where's his pal? His pal's there. Oh, he's guarding that freaking door. Right, so hang on. Can I distract that enemy? Oh, but is that going to work? Oh, there's another guy in there. Shit. I'm trying to be stealthy. Do, 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 do. do you think I could get him without anyone notice? Oh, he can't see shit. He doesn't know. These fucking speakers. Use the path marked by T-Bug. She suggests going in there. I wonder if I could get in there without them noticing. Is there anything? There's there's this, but it's a bit close to me. Let's... Did I do it? Oh, he turned around. This guy over here is a real problem. Why is he looking at me? I should have killed him already! Ugh, oh, now he's kind of facing this way. Didn't really help. Yeah, he definitely sees me. Jackie, what are we gonna do? <laughs> Shit. Shit. That guy in there is fine. I think I need to take him out, but I'm worried that that guy's... Oh, he's coming back. He's coming back. Okay, okay, okay. Fucking job, Jackie. Good job. Anything in here? No. Okay, I'm gonna quick save. <sighs> Alright, so there's a guy there. Anything in here that we need to loot? Not really, by the looks of things. <laughs> Jackie just flew at him. <laughs> Pack of cards. Right, this guy... Do I have anything I can distract? I can distract him with the light. I don't know if that would be enough, though. He might not come around. Let's find out. <laughs> don't turn around. 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 Don't turn... He's <laughs> looking directly into the fucking light. <laughs> 
Looks like you got him. There to go. Okay. Where the hell's the target? Look around. Gotta be there somewhere. All right, sweet. We did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. My bestie needs me. <laughs> he moves across the map. Literally. Literally. Hell yeah, Nom. You should absolutely treat yourself. Pay or your head will explode. Hey, Chum, today's your unlucky day. you probably wondering who I am. I'm a voodoo boy. Probably heard of us. Remember the last time you hit the net? Yeah, me too. I hack your code processor and install a little surprise for you. Now you do what I say or your head goes boom. I think 1,000 eddies is a fair pay to keep your head. If you pay, I uninstall my surprise. If not, I blow up your head, but blow up the head of the person you love the most first. And if you tell NCPD, I blow up your head twice. <laughs> you have two days to pay. I know you read this because I installed a spy cam in your optics. We read it together. This is not a negotiation, Chum. So do not reply. Just pay and you will live. Implants for cheap, cheap, cheap. Huge savings on discounted secondhand cyberware. Don't miss out. Today's deals. Plastic sin skin. Pink. Hand size M. Second gen. Used one week only. Near mint condition. Tech hair. Green. Shoulder length. Luminescent. Second gen. Moderate use. Occasional flickering. Faint cigarette smoke smell. Alloy feet. Chrome. Unpainted. Men's size A. First gen. Light. What are you doing back there, Jackie? Light rust from lake water exposure. Price redu reduction due to lack of owner records. Synthetic calf muscle, red, no casing, mint condition, second gen, retrofit capable with older joint models. Items go fast, so buy now. Continue following us for the latest and best deals. No worries, Osric. See you soon. Imagine buying lightly used sex hand skin. I know. Need someone to watch your back? Danger prowls, Night City. Animals are alpha. Got a stalker on your tail? Hired iron out for your blood? Some freak giving you crooked looks and bad vibes? Not the bad vibes. <laughs> You're just looking to find your personal security. The animals got your back. Survival of the fit. Oh my God. The ASCII kills me. Survival of the fittest is the only law that matters in Night City. You hire us. We show your enemies just what that means. We'll protect you, your home, your workplace, your property. Hell, we're even happy to knock on a few doors if necessary. Become the king of the jungle. Choose the animals. <laughs> the little ASCII art is so good. <laughs> All right. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's Jackie. Jesus Christ, Jackie. Oh, mommy. Flat out daughter, we could be that sneaky. Ah, uh, me too. Euro dollars, I'll take them. Man, it's not my favorite way to roll, but Nova anyway. That's okay. Uh, what's in here? Messages. Toys. Got a lot of good stuff. Hand from Zeta Attack uses biosignature, but we ordered jailbreak. Mill attack lock on sites. This is from Gomp. Uh, wonder where this gunk got it. Arasaka hormone regulator, no bio signature, and some other little curiosities. Optics actuator and cosmetic real skin. He uses ASCII. I know, right? Fresh meat. That's the same one as before. Okay, let's go. I think we actually cleared everybody out here. Oh, here we go. Jesus fucking Christ. Check body. No, fuck that guy. <laughs> I think I got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, Jack into our biomod. Need to know what we're dealing with. She's in a tub of ice. Crammed good. in with another. Fuck. Like slaps of meat. <laughs> Keep it together, V. If she survives, she won't remember a thing. Tiny scar on the subconscious, that's all. Heard people who live through shit like this get panic attacks. Without ever knowing why. You'll be sipping a glass of ice cold water and suddenly your hands shaking. V, Jack into her biomod. We need to know what we're dealing with. Check her biomod. Checking in. I think this is a really cool feature. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomod, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neurocord. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomod. Is that even safe? Can't we just get her out of here? We found her still breathing. Can't lose her. We need that biomon working, checking for hemorrhages, whatever. Find that shard and yank it. Found the shard. Removing now. Check the biomon. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume... <laughs> if you are conscious. Now, an 
emergency evacuation unit day. has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biome Enclave's trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Jack, look sharp. Not done yet. Don't know who's out there. Locked and ready, V. Do your thing. All right, let's go. <laughs> System oh, malfunction. Don't drop her! She's flatlining! V, need to know what's going on. Jackie, air hypo! Fuck, this is bad! Catch, Chica! <laughs> Imagine if you just dropped her straight on the floor. I think. Oh shit, it worked. Fuera, chica. Get her outside. Okay, let's go. I am crouching. Mm. I probably shouldn't be. <laughs> just creeping along the floor. <laughs> Must have seen trauma. Decided to cut their losses. Alright. Let's head outside. Fuera, get her out. Terrace. You got it. Here they come. Landing. Stand clear. Initiating security protocol. Follow all instructions. All right. Stop in the doorway. Okay. Sorry. Jeez. Uh, Kiki mode makes you go faster. Place the patient on the ground. Okay. Steps back. Jesus fucking Christ, they're aggressive. TT-133 to control. Patient NC-570442 secured. Secured. Stimulants being administered. We did that. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for Brennigan. The way they're still staring at me with their guns like, Jesus fucking Christ. Bye. Okay. Love their helmets. Yeah, their helmets are pretty cool. Hey, Jackie. Let's get out of here. Elevator gets us to the garage direct. Okie dokie. Good work. Shit we did it. Over. We did it stealthily. Cutting my wires now. See you in the near future. See you soon, T bug. I don't think I looted the guy that you got, so give me one second. Yeah, you can borrow my car. Oh. Jesus Christ. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, there. There's a gun. Won't leave you hanging, Jack. Yeah, you can use the dark. Don't be used to it. I feel like, um, wasn't there a book about trauma team? You're saving my ass, V. Thank you. How about I drive you In my now? car? Yeah, sure. She's all yours. Pet the kittens. Do I have a kitten? I do. Is it is. Oh, almost forgot. No she future. She can in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. Okay. Using your phone. Call Wakako. Well is a strong word. Yeah, relatively well. Trauma it's true. The paramedics didn't see me. She'll recover. Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish yes. to be now. Yes. Very much. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you're to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks right. for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Trauma team used to be chill, but repeated conflicts really fuck their patients to the point Where's that they're not happily armed. Gonna put Watson Interesting. On lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight. We better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Chica. I'm driving. Once again, an RPG where I walk too fast. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, I'm not driving. <laughs> Forgot. <laughs> Heart beating and the bills are covered. Yeah, no kidding. All right, let's go. Ride back with Jackie. I like this uh, tune. I should really level up, but I'll wait. I just feel like I'm going to die. Can't stop digging Night City. 
Uh huh. City like any other. Just, just bigger. bigger. <laughs> nah, chica. Not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand, Andrew Wayland, Adam Smasher. Smash. Legends are born here. Yeah, legends also die here. Jackie. Just saying. Man, I'm starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? You got a date. You're locking down Watson, member. Oh shit. You're right. Is it just me or oh, fucking knew it? Great. I don't like it. Not one tiny bit. Here we go. Holy shit. Fucking drive, Jackie. Come on, B. I'm trying my best. Hold her steady. Holy shit. Hold tight, B. Ow. <laughs> very hard is very hard. <laughs> what happens if they gun down someone with trauma team insurance? Bad things. I like Jackie and your homeboy son. I just like him. I love Jackie. Oh shit. Let's try that again. Right. Holy shit! I was not prepared. Can't hit people with katanas. How do I heal? X. Trying my best. Okay, we're good. Where the fuck are you going? You nearly ran that woman over! Got you, asshole! B! Aim for the driver! Okay, 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 okay. Nice! We good. That's all good. Scratched your baby over. Sorry. Sorry, V. It's okay. I can wait. Let's just focus on getting home. Yeah, at least we're not being followed anymore, right? Oh, but all their loot, though. Uh, let's just not look at that ad with the butt. Drive faster. <laughs> I'm sure Jackie can drive faster than that. Damn. They're pulling out all the stuff. They really are. Look at Mac! Hi. Necessary security measure. RP driving. Officer, ma'am. Officer, ma'am. Are we ever lucky we ran into you? Really? What's it that makes me so special? A heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? He has a dick! Uh huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. Be worried sick? I mean, I'm trying to be a stand up guy. Is she giving me a chance? It's waiting. Mm, that's a okay. shame. No model citizen, maybe, but. <laughs> Look at him, no model citizen. <laughs> He's a good kid. He's just through. a little guy. <laughs> okay, on your way. You have a good evening now, officer. Officer, ma'am. Ma Bye, officer, ma'am. Good job. Smooth talking. So you can be nice when you feel like it. When am I not nice? <laughs> um, always. I'm always never not nice. I don't know what that means, but okay. <laughs> I'm always never not nice. Am I Jackie? <laughs> whoop, whoop. I wonder if this whole situation is like actually possible. Nice hat, bud. That does not seem like the smart choice. Doesn't look like your average boss. This ain't your average badges. It's Max Tech. NCPD's Jeez. Apex Predators. MTech rolls in with the Jackie fly. just a little guy wells. Dogs out there though. Just a midday snack for him. Well, show's over. Poor bastards. But they had it coming. I think it does look a lot prettier now. 
Definitely. All right, so we can skip the rest of the ride because we finished all the stuff, but I think we're actually really close to the end anyway, so we just ride. I kind of like that. Almost at your place. Yay. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood now. I like the three miles. <laughs> the poster. You sure about that? Oh, yeah. I'll play nice Jackie again. Uh-huh. Look at my weird cat thing on my dash. Everywhere I look, I'm reminded of her. I have no idea, Dragon. Sweet dreams, then. Thanks. All right, good night. Tell Misty I said hi. I will. Hi, luego. See you later. And he's off with my car. And we leveled up. Let's hack and go. Oh, wait, the lift's already here. Silly me. I can level up when I get upstairs. Okay. Good evening, night. Hack you. Hey, T Bug. Bug? Forgot earlier. Burning my tires. Something you could probably use. <laughs> More kicks. Zipping your deeds. Job from T Bug. The task T Bug has given you is important step in the path to developing your net running skills. Be sure to complete it. Okay, that's cool, but we gotta go home first. Does he know how much tires cost? A lot. Mac and cheeses. Bing. All right, let's go. Time to pack up and get home. Just two hours and a ferry ride. Two hours and a ferry ride. Stupid gates busted again. Third time. I'm home. All right, go to bed. Check your op your weapons stash. Yeah, no, I would like to check my wardrobe. Let's do fashion. Okay, so. Uh, you can, I did not understand this because this is very different to what it was like when it launched. You have up to six outfits saved in your wardrobe. These can be activated and deactivated in the outfit section of your inventory at any time. Activating a wardrobe outfit will change the appearance of the clothing you have equipped, but will not change its stats. All clothing you find, receive, craft, disassemble, buy, or sell will be saved in your wardrobe's memory. Okay. So I have the wolf school jacket because the world in 2077 could still use a monster hunter. Definitely not a monster fucker. That's not what I read. Um, these pants or these streetwear pants. So her streetwear pants are gold. <laughs> I don't know if I like that so much. <laughs> but I done something silly and kept every single individual type of clothing in my storage in my last playthrough. So I'm going through and turning all of that into crafting mats. Smart, smart. Um, I want sneakers. Okay, okay, okay. I don't have any hats or anything. All right, I'm going to equip that. So that's my outfit. So we look like... Okay, well, we don't have very good lighting, but we do look good. That ass is golden. Hell yeah, it is! Uh, open. All right, give me my other stuff. I know I have stuff in my stash. Give me my other stuff. I have a t-shirt. I have a Witcher t-shirt. Look! I should probably equip that. And a Galaxy shirt. Um... A black unicorn iconic katana crafted for perfect balance. Attack speed is not affected by stamina. I'm going to go ahead and take that. Look at this outfit. V's tattered crop top. Galaxy shirt. It's the GOG Galaxy t-shirt. All right, hold on. I need to adjust my wardrobe. Can I inner torso? Okay, so you can't see the inner torso when you're wearing the jacket anyway. That's fine. Right, let's go weapon. I would like my iconic katana. My black unicorn, um, the claw. You're still wearing that crop top. All right, I need to, I may as well put, I guess, I don't know, an assault rifle? I have no idea. I don't like the paint job on it. All right, so here we are. Here's our cyberware menu, but I am nowhere near being able to do anything with that. The claw, streamer goodies, but you want all the things. These were not streamer goodies. The, the katana and stuff was from having the Witcher and for having God Galaxy. I didn't, I didn't get them for anything else. Right, I have one attribute point and one perk point. <sighs> Reflexes is for blades. I'm gonna go in here. Holy, look at the tree. Oh my goodness. So this takes you to, okay, that's cool. All right, all right, all right. Slippery. The faster you move, the more difficult en for enemies to shoot you. Effects increases when dashing, dodging, sliding, sprinting, and vaulting. It's a lot. 
Um, so I need to take this, I guess, to move up. Um, holy moly, I want this. So this is lead and steel. This is where you can block bullets! Unlocks the ability to block incoming projectiles with blades. I need it. I, I need it. I need it. Uh, finisher Blade Runner. The skill tree was completely changed. Everything about the skill tree has been completely changed. Um, stuff's been moved around. There's been new stuff. I need it. <laughs> so I'm going to take Slippery. And then I can take this. Now, how does this work then? This requires me to... How do I unlock it? Do I have to have taken all of these or just... Requires... Okay. Um, power slide. Parkour! Increased vaulting and climbing speed. Muscle memory allows you to reload weapons while sprinting, sliding, and vaulting. Multitasker allows you to shoot while sprinting, sliding, and vaulting. That's pretty nice. So I need to get to nine to get to here? Is that what that means? Because it says six of nine. Right. Okay. Woo! All right. So I will take reflexes is how that works, right? Oh, it's hold F to purchase. There we go. Skill progression. Holy moly, I don't remember this. 4, 9, 15, 20. Headhunter, Netrunner, Shinobi, Solo, and Engineer. Interesting. Major Tremor, thank you for gifting five subs to the community. I really appreciate it. Thank you. If you just got gifted a sub by Major Tremor, please enjoy your emotes. Feel free to slap people your tentacles with consent. That's why they're called consentacles. And feel free to continue lurking if you're lurking. I'm sorry. My alerts are off right now because I'm wary of potentially interrupting like story stuff because it's a very, very story heavy game. But thank you so much. Just a reminder, if you give two subs to this community today, to any two people in this community, in this stream, while I'm playing Cyberpunk, you will get a Yasha sniper rifle to use in um, Phantom Liberty when it launches tomorrow. Need to become a Borg for the six of nine stuff. Right, so we've got reflexes at seven now. I'm seven of nine. <laughs> Hi, Zitwar, how are you? All right, so I'm okay with that. I think I'm good with that. Let me have a, ooh, over substance. Body needs some tweaks. Approach the mirror in the apartment or safe house and select your change appearance option. Get some, got some favorite threads, create outfits in your apartment's wardrobe so you can change the appearance of your equipped clothing whenever you want. I would like to have a little peek at myself. Look in the mirror. Look, it's me. Okay, I like my character a lot. <laughs> Change facial expression. Smile. Smirk. Okay, scowl. I love her. Pout. The pout doesn't really look like much. Gawk. <laughs> <laughs> stare stare is pretty much the same stop looking she's so cool I love her she's so much cooler than me alright I'm gonna go have a sleepy sleep do you remember whenever the game first launched and you like got into your bed incorrectly it's me hi I'm the punk it's me <laughs> Yeah, it is a lot. Uh, well, it's a lot less useful, but it's also a lot less stressful to deal with. Act one. We finished the prologue. We're into act one. Let's hack and go. Angie Psyche. All right, we're up. We're awake. We're alive. Check your email. Okay, I can do that. I have a computer. Wait, my phone. Whoa, V. You get your beauty sleep? I did. No Shut up. Why? <laughs> I think I might have caught something when I jacked into that corpo's biome on. I don't know, a neurovirus or... I feel like shit. I need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's going on. I like Vic. My stomach churning. Okay, yeah, let me incorrectly. You. She slept sideways. I brought you a ride. Yeah, throwing some threads, meet me downstairs. Okay, you got it. Let me read my messages. Uh, Mega Medicine Lottery. Attention, Mega Medicine Lottery. Buy two tickets, get the third for free. Thousands of tickets are, sorry, thousands of prizes are still available. Drugs, reanimators, primary care appointments, surgery vouchers, blood screens, cyberpsychosis vaccines, ripper dog referrals, and our grand prize, a one-year trauma team premium package. Hurry while supplies last. Your neighbors already have their tickets. Buy yours now. Less than three, less than three, less than three. Penis nanogel scam alert. 
Warning, scam alert. Do not click on any emails with ads for penis enlargement nanogel. This is a scam. Ordinary gels cannot stimulate new cell growth. The only tested and proven method for penis enhancement is still the Aerosex hormone treatment. Our scientists at Aerosex have developed a formula that will dramatically increase the length and girth of your penis in only seven days. Join the thousands of other satisfied customers and order your kit today. I didn't believe it would work, but I was desperate. I only had a week to get my penis big. Why is there a time limit? <laughs> well, time to return a few packages. Hi, Scorpio. How are you? <laughs> and I knew Mr. Stud wouldn't cut it. Fortunately, Aerosex did the trick, and I've still got the nail marks on my back to prove it. Thanks, Aerosex. Richard Towers, real customer. <laughs> Verified penis growth. Order now while supplies last. That's what people who don't want to share the penis nanogel would say. <laughs> Clock's ticking. Change one letter. <laughs> Alert, you've been attacked. Warning, malware detected. Your computer has been attacked by three demons. Our system detected two attempts to obtain your personal data. One attempts to corrupt your neural processor. Immediate action required. Our quick threat neutralization software can prevent identity theft and implant hijacking. Remember, hostile netrunners can infiltrate your nervous system and force you to commit terrible crimes such as fraudulent bank transfers, assault, theft and or armed robbery, suicide. To protect yourself, click the scan now button. Our sophisticated anti-demon software will eliminate all threats immediately. If you do not scan in the next five minutes, 17 seconds, your operating system may suffer irreversible damage. Protect yourself now. I wish I was being attacked by three demons. Me too. No worries, Scorpio. Good morning. Auto fixer. On the auto fixer net page, you'll find all vehicles currently out for sale. Oh, is this different? You can access the net page from the computer in your apartment or from other computers throughout Night City marked with a car icon. A vehicle's picture may display an icon to indicate that it comes equipped with a built-in weapon. Is T the anti-demon software? Yes. <laughs> I lost. As your street cred grows, so will the number of vehicles available to you on Autofixer. What up, valued Truman customer? Let me guess. Still driving that old sad wheels and bored out of your gourd? El Capitan's got you covered. Check out my new net page, Autofixer. Pretty slick name if you ask me <laughs> to find your new ride today. Just click pay and boom. Night City streets are all yours. You demand El Capitan supplies. Simple as that. What are you waiting for? Visit Autofixer now and bye bye bye. That's smart. That is smart. I like that. That's definitely better. So can I see auto fixer? Triple A auto fixer. Okay, sweet. Hey, bot. I don't think Twitch can count. Are you still there? Uncle Bot, thank you for the resub. Welcome back. Happy 20 months. Um, so what have we got? We got the Archer. Sorry, Archer's the name of the brand, apparently. I like the look of this. The Cthulhu? Oh, I'm in. I'm in. I never really bought any cars. I bought my... <laughs> I bought the Akira bike and then I was happy. Okay. Rayfield. I am not buying that. I refuse. Okay. <gasps> that! The Kusanagi! I need it so much! I need the Kusanagi! <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> the Motoko bike! Although it's the Akira bike. But I like your Motoko bike like a motorbike. I like it. It's good. Want to play this game and do the most normie character possible? <laughs> you can play a Corpo. Corpos are assholes. I played Corpo on my YouTube playthrough and they made me feel bad. Bad. How are you doing? The perk tree is so different. So different. So different. Right. Meet with Jackie. Let's go. Okay. No. Hello, Regina. Hey, V. Regina Jones here. Hey, Regina. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How did you find me? How did you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. <gasps> True, Mecca. I hadn't thought of that. Bye. Right, I'm going to look. I know that they've reduced the, like, ambient random loot situation, but I kind of want to have a look and see. Yeah, just random shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, there's still some, but... What the fuck just happened to that person? Open up. Hi. Oh. <laughs> I can grab them. Can I help? No. Didn't they get mad at me the last time? Have they changed that so that if you walk towards the police, they don't inherently decide that they're just going to smack you in the face? What else we got up here? Any loot? I don't actually see any loot. I looted the heck out of this place on my other playthrough. 
So they made it less realistic. <laughs> also looks really cool when you turn on the rim lights. How do you turn on the rim lights? Why does this child... I don't think this child understands how hopscotch works. They have fallen over like four times playing hopscotch. <laughs> oh, I see. I'm sorry. Future hopscotch is harder. Yeah, Sky Blue, if it's the one I'm thinking of that I got on my other playthrough, yes, 100%. I actually used it a lot for that reason. They're just doing straight scotch, no hop. <laughs> Not everyone can be as good at hop scotch as you are. Yeah, you heard it here for a psyche pro hop scotch, but not very good at anything else. <laughs> they peaked in primary school. I heard Knife Yanger wanted them the whole of the NCPD. Will it be after you? I heard that too. Am I supposed to be using a lift? Because I sure as heck didn't. I'm looking over here. Like, this is so dangerous. This is so dangerous. Showed off her hopscotch shit. skills and Come powers. On. All right. <laughs> Go to work. <laughs> T said no, she was playing drop scotch like the girls playing. <laughs> <sighs> One foot in front of the other, let's go. Right, okay, I think I was supposed to, oh wait, maybe I was supposed to go this way. I forget. What happens in Paris stays in Paris. Yeah, some of my blood, because <laughs> I fell. Me too, Thrash. I was thinking that too. Oh, heck. Hey, yo, v. What's up? How about a round or two? I don't know. We're playing. What do you say? I don't know. We're playing on very like hard difficulty. I feel like he's going to punch the shit out of me. me a next -gen ass whooping. He he's going to give me a next gen ass whooping. To see how he handles the life gotcha, of Machete. <laughs> so, how about it? How's it going? How's it going? Fight's about to start. Not gonna watch? Take notes? Malone versus Hernandez. <laughs> nah. Our chrome friend here don't watch TV. Yes. Don't Is talk, right? Very real still. The way he communicates with them this. Where'd you get him? Where'd you get him, Fred? Off the street. Saw him looking up at me with these big, sad eyes. So I took the Aww. poor pup in. Fed him, clothed him. <laughs> nah, for real. He's a military. Okay, I liked it better when you got, got him off the street. <laughs> and a tumor mine tossed in a few upgrades. Now, here we are. All right. Sure, why not? Let's do this. I'm going to get my Let ass handed to me. That head moving. Fist fights. Your fists can be dangerous weapons. In fist fights, you can use them to both strike your enemies and block their attacks. Oh, shit. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! Get back here! Ow! Can I... Can I heal? No? Am I not alive? That's all right. Playing on hard, very hard difficulty. I don't know if that was a good idea. Let's do this. I have to beat him? Okay, okay, okay. Come on then. He pushes me! Pushing's cheating! I pushed him out of the ring. That should be, that should be him out now. Kick him! Kick him in the face! You got one hell of a punch there. Oh, I did it! I beat him! Monetizing it? I can arrange a fight or two. What do you say? No way. You go in the ring yourself? I don't think I ever did these missions. The call's taking too much of a beating. This isn't sumo. There's ways of fixing that. Karenzikov should do this. Never had a Karenzikov. Rather dish out my eddies for something else. It's time I started taking it easy. Fair. You mentioned something about fighting? Hmm. I've seen you land in blows in the ring. You've got sharp instinct. We'll see about that. You can go far, especially if you get chipped. These fights, let's just say they aren't legal. Crime! But <laughs> very lucrative. Lucrative for who? You or me? 
Both of us. I get a small percentage of the total winnings, you know, as your uh -huh. agent. I love crime. You get the rest. Sounds fair. Sounds fair. It's like I said. Good instinct. He's just saying that because he can make money off me. The city. You choose where you want to go. Put down your eddies and start swinging. You win, you take home the pipe. All right. Manage to drop every last one of them. You get a chance to fight in the grand finale. Hey, Taco. That all clear? Crystal. Good. Oh, except you won't be setting foot outside or what? Not yet. You can start in Kabuki. Okay. I get it, loser. We're you. going criming. <laughs> Time to show this city what you made of. Sweet. What's this? I'm gonna take it. Taco, thank you for the resub. Happy 25 months. Welcome back. How are you? Be gay, do crime. All right. Didn't you have something for me last time? I feel like you had something for me. Sweet little 45, you say? Do I have to pay for it? I don't remember. <laughs> Collect your gun from Wilson. Let's see it. Let's have a look. All right, what you got? Dying Night. Wilson's Lexington gives you the additional hope of seeing yet another Night City sunrise. Increases damage while moving and guarantees shock with rapid hits. It's free! <laughs> I love that. Free's my favorite price. <laughs> These already committed plenty of crimes. What's a bit of unofficial street brawling tournament? True. <clears throat> hope you're having a great day. I hope you all had a great weekend, friends. Bought the infamous Pastelins Four Horsemen book. Oh, tell me about it. Upgrading iconic weapons. You just acquired an iconic weapon. Iconic weapons possess unique abilities. However, they cannot be improved with weapon mods. With the appropriate components, iconic weapons can be upgraded to a higher tier, which significantly improves their power. You can do this from the upgrades tab of the crafting menu. Iconic weapons can be found all over Night City. You might receive one from a friend or loot one off an enemy. It's also possible to find some simply lying in the ground or available for purchase at vendors. Some you might even craft yourself. Hi, Cypher. Good morning. How are you? Free 99 my favorite price. All right, bye. I gotta meet with Jackie. All right, we're using the lift, are we? Welcome to N54 News. I'm Jillian Jordan. Should probably finish the series first. Getting this set up for this evening? I'm sorry, you're feeling meh. I hope everything improves. Have you decided already what you're playing in Cyberpunk? The festival program will also include musical performances All right. by BWAR virtuosos. I got so lost in Nice City. <laughs> the, known the sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation. Not Arasaka! Exciting development. Even Hanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the right. Dashi Parade. Let's go. I like this kind of vibe as well. We wish you a safe you know. fun must so. Street Kid probably my PS5 save seems to be on the cloud, but I do remember them saying it might be better to start fresh. I decided to start fresh. I So I had heard a bit of both, but I have a couple of friends who've played quite far into the game and said that they tried to play and they were so overwhelmed with the changes that they just decided to start fresh. I don't think you have to, but I decided to. Cypher, thank you for gifting five subs to the community. I really appreciate that. It was super kind. Friends, if you just got gifted a sub by Cypher Tier, please enjoy your emotes. Feel free to slap people with your tentacles with consent. This weather called consentacles, and feel free to continue lurking if you're lurking. Thank you so much. My introduce you to the way of Goku punch really, really hard. <laughs> Why finish one book when you start five different ones and finish none of them? <laughs> Aw, thank you so much. Hell yeah, the rifle. I appreciate that so much. That's so, so kind. Thank you, Cypher. Cypher, you're, you're going to TwitchCon, right? I really wish I was going. Maybe next year. I would really, really like to hang. Um, okay, NCBD scanner hustles. The NCBD will pay you to help fight crime. Gigs, fixers will contact you when you approach a gig's location. And fixers, these intermediaries will inform you about local gigs. All right, cool. Ads in three. Yeah, I'm going to take a super short break. So we're actually not going to talk to... He look at him waving. Oh, I love him so much. Let's go talk to Jackie. You on a train? Where are you going, Kiki? New GPU shift. Hell yes, as he. That's exciting. Hello. Of the hour. Jeez. It took you long enough. I do have a large an appetite just waiting. It's so good, man. Sit down. Let me finish this. Psyche Punk 2077 time. On Senor Vector. Okay, what you eating? Didn't figure you as the type for Asian. Who thought you'd find it too exotic? What do you mean? What's there not to like? Noodles? Check. Since sirloin. Check. Get some more chile action up in here, and you're looking at Mama Wells' signature sopa de fideos. 
Did you have a surprise me? mentioned something about a surprise. <gasps> you do, Cypher? Cool. Right or just had a brain fart. Brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. That's true. But it just so happens. Oh, God. I might have bagged us a sweet ass J O B. A J O B? I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds. He speaks a lot about afterlife. Street kid! Dex ain't under the picture. Thought Dex bounced out of the ring a few years ago. Oh, Rested right. A nasty crew in Pacific. Bond installations of pain. got ugly. Mm hmm. Gang wars two years back. Somehow Dex got caught up in the craziness. There's a lot of bodies lying in the streets by the time the shooting stopped. Is Jackie yeah, single? Because I can. Though. Managed to slip under the radar till tempers cooled. Took a while, but. He's made one hell of a comeback. Okay. This is it, Jackie, our big break. <laughs> this is it, Jackie, our break. Dex needs friends, needs us. We can use him. Amen, Chica. It's a win-win. The animations are really good. How'd you manage this? How did you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You me? Oh, but T-Buck. She's the one that great. Us up, got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on, ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? <laughs> sure, Jack. <laughs> Whatever you say. I'm fine. What's the job? So what's the gig? We meant to come hey, out in one way. Well, our savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. No pressure, but system malfunction. Old deals riding on you now, chica. No pressure. We'll see why not. All right, let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is in a league of his own. You know what I'm saying? I know my way around fixers. Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit, hit the nail on the head, V. It's called fashion, Dr. Sparklebacks? Gave to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after Thanks. our uh, dust up with the scabs. Yeah, I know the ambience is really good. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. You can call your vehicle to your current location with a V. Okay. Some top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's go. The car's here. Let's feel this factory new ride. Okay. I like his jacket a lot, actually. As he, you, wasn't it you who made fun of me for getting lost <laughs> in Night City? Oh yeah, I get to drive now. You started it. <laughs> My car. I'm not very good at driving. I am really sorry. Ripper Doc. Anchica, easy on the gas, eh? I just ate. I'll try my best. Uh, how do I change view? Switch oh, camera. To stop by Vix anyhow. I got a date. I'm not very good at driving in video games, so you you're going to have to excuse me, okay? So Maybe I don't want to drive this way. Really Hold on. Me, you know? I'm sure this is fine. Look at my... Oh, it's a dog, not a cat. Whoa, what just happened? Hello? Can't see shit from behind this dashboard. I'm too short. I am too short. I'm not sure that I feel that driving this way is a good idea, but that's okay. We got yeah, it. I crash so much because I always drive in first person with the radio on, so I'd be head lagging constantly. We'll hash out what Dex is cooked up for us. Okay, you got it. Grab a controller to drive with. Actually, maybe. Is it easy enough to switch between them on the fly? Car is armored by poor driving is someone else's problem. <laughs> <laughs> but you are not isn't this isn't this co carnage? For your eyes do not belong to you, or rather, <laughs> not only to you. Fair play, man. <laughs> Checking them out. All right, let's go. Is this where I'm supposed to go? In here? Or was it in here? Oh, it's in here. Sorry. Hi. Hey, 
Misty's cute. Dr. Vector will see you now. Sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. Hello, Franco. Eating a cookie in your car. What kind of cookie? Please. Because I am. Always. She's so cute. I love her. But She's so sweet. We got a new job lined up. I'm a big hitter at the Look at her little her little cat. Oh. And we also have this. Is it gonna be dangerous? Don't you worry, mi amor. We're bulletproof. Silmar, thank you for giving us up the Franco. Franco, stay dry. And take all of these. Okay, let's go. We're bulletproof. Mm. Cat! <gasps> can I pet the cat? Can I pet the cat? Can I pet the cat? I can pet the cat! I can pet the cat! Wait, I don't remember being able to pet the cat! Ah! I don't, were we always able to pet the cat? Or is that new? I love why we can still hear co ranting in the background. It's a cat, Solu! Get the fuck out! <laughs> it's new! I love it! Oh, my, look at him. <laughs> Hi. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I got distracted. I got distracted, but for good reason. Hey, Victor. I like Vic. Good to see you. Time to buy the game. <laughs> Though a common practice, cyberware installation is still a dangerous and invasive procedure, which can only be performed by qualified specialists. Ripper docs. That's a lovely chicken breast. <laughs> there are several Ripper docs operating throughout Night City who offer a variety of different cyberware upgrades. Select your desired cybernetic upgrade from the list and enjoy your new abilities. Good to see you too, V. Hiya. What do I owe the pleasure today? I like Vic. Last gig, had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity Spunky to monkey. bright lights. Oh, kitten caboodle. Kitten caboodle. All I right, almost called the kittens kitten we'll caboodle. Sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Have you heard of Dexter Deshawn? Met a new fixer. Gave me a job. Hear me, I was older. Dexter Deshawn. Why not both? Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But something you're not telling me, Vic. Keep your guard up. That's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Okay. Need some new. Hey, Sander. How are tools, you? Tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean. The screwdriver! Major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dex to Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. I have but all the symptoms of no guess. cool cyberware. Hasn't paid Wait. you yet. Mm -mm. Hey, you want the job's done? Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the eddies later with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Yeah. Thank you. His hand, so cool. Chair, please. Sit down and relax. You got it. My little feet. <laughs> Kuroshi Optics. Sweet. Best I've got and should be about right under the circumstances. If you're weird and squeamish about your eyes being touched, you may Not wish to look yet. away briefly. What is banging up there? Kuroshi, whoa. Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy then. You're, you're right. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. Duck in. <laughs> Do you need a cyber You peruse seat? and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. What if I'm squeamish and weird, but eye stuff doesn't bother me? Well, this is different. This is a different menu. Okay, I would like my Kuroshi optics. Yes. Cyberware you acquire in the world can be installed or sold at any Ripper Dog clinic. Cyberware capacity indicates the amount of cyberware your body can handle. So I guess like 27 is my max. This limit increases you level up, acquire certain perks, and use cyberware capacity shards. Oh, okay, cool. You got it. How do I get out of this menu? And then hands. I'm going to have the ballistic co-processor. They look like dodgy backstreet medics. They do. Okay, are we done? Oh, enter augmentary system. Subdermal armor. Okay, cool. That's neat. That's different. 
All right, cool. Mark one, like I said, That's decent nice. enough scanner. Displays <laughs> data on your cornea. <laughs> Cherry on the tops so of built in external. You don't need the pants, now. you get the jacket and stuff next week. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your faces of. Oh, water. yeah, for sure, Fluffy. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Okay, cool. Kind of, mm. Surly. This should do the trick. Yeah, it's all cyber wearing all clothing. Kuroshi clothing doesn't two. have any stats anymore. I'm ready. Car Exclamation away. mark sniper Kiki. Excellent. <laughs> Let's do this. All right. Well, eye warning now. Lay oh, wait. I think I'm doing the hand first. Arm of yours right here. Or did he just not do the eye thing? As in, like, the eye pokey thing. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, what a great name. Honest, not much. And that's oh, yeah. You get all these changes without the DLC. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town. I've been sleeping nights ever since. Hell yeah. <clears throat> just like that. Thanks. Sniper, Kiki. <laughs> now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. This is, uh... Feel anything? Creepy. Am I the Perfectly dentist? Though, really, Doc? Makes you sound like a dentist. Always going on and mm -hmm. on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a <laughs> shaky Gannick hand. <laughs> Could slip. Oh, here we go. Lights out for a minute. All Eyeball! Right. Ah! <laughs> it freaks me out. <laughs> it really freaks me out. Ah, some headpieces give you quick X stuff or melee resistance, etc. Gotcha. Okay, let's we test good? this. Let's see the magic in action. Linking you in. Hey! Look! You I can see I can see my own body! Bird vision, <laughs> low contrast, That's so witches. weird. <laughs> and we put the eyeball in. Amazing. Well, oh, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Better than ever. Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. I like Victor. Victor Vector, <laughs> oh, what a beautiful. cool name. All right. Scanning people. Scanning people with your optical cyberware can provide you with a lot of useful information, such as how strong an enemy might be, who is in their crew, or what type of weapon they use. As a skilled netrunner, you can see a list of quick hacks that you can use against your enemy. Time for the scanner. Okay. Hi, Victor Vector, civilian. It might take you Best a few Doc and Watson. Adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything really. Scanner should eventually sync with your <laughs> thought processes, so read your stop. intentions. All right, cool. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. Ne'er did well. Database of wanted persons. A database of individuals with bindings assigned to them is now available to use. You can identify these wanted persons with your scanner. Since all are wanted dead or alive, the methods used to claim your reward are entirely up to you. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Nice. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. Hell yeah. Nice. That's not my weapon. <laughs> I want my other weapon. <laughs> How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you I don't think it? I actually equipped it. Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. Thanks, Vic. You're certified bug free. Shit, Victor, not bad. Where's the site? Look, that's the wrong weapon, say. okay? Don't worry about it. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now and another two in an hour. You got it. What am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muscle. It wasn't my gun, it was a random pistol. <laughs> You're the best, Vic. I owe you. Thanks, bud. I do owe him. I owe him money. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show him what you're made of. Alright, you got it. And once He's talking to me, but I would like to switch this pistol out. But this pistol! There we go. You hit the big leagues. Don't forget where you came you from. You betcha. 
Right, well, I mean, it's, what? what? Who's winning? Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. Now, every last fire oh, has got, got job extra complete. skull line. Absorb 75% of every blow. You got cash riding on this? Nah, just looking. <laughs> it's out of habit more than anything else. Miss it, don't you? Uh, How's Biz? How's Biz going? Uh, <laughs> Corpos learned to keep their distance, and Sokka's back hiring lone mercs. They all gotta have the newest, shiniest implants. You think you got Misty here to help? Handles your gripe and well. Yeah, right now. I don't think you can use him as a ripper doll if you don't pay him. Made. No what? Seems like you're the only person in Night City who's happy with his law. <laughs> you get to a certain age, you drop all your illusions. Life just gets easier from there. All right. Um, let me see. Oh, I had a message. Can I open my phone from here? I don't think so. Uh. T. Come on, V. What's taking so long? Move your ass, Chica. Dex is waiting on us. All right, dude. He says. Yeah, he doesn't do any work until you pay him off. And I think he has some decent upgrades, so. That scared the crap out of me! <laughs> I don't think he has any loot. They've removed all of the random ambient loot, so now I don't feel like being a loot goblin anymore. What is this nonsense? Imagine. All right. Okay, let's go. Oh, wait, can we use his computer? Late from Missy to Victor. Running late, sorry, hugs. <laughs> You're fucked. That's the message we read. Biotechnica, work with us from Abigail Eden. Dear Victor, my name is Abigail Eden and I'm a headhunter for Biotechnica. I was wondering if maybe you'd consider joining the world's most socially conscious, environmentally friendly corporate family. <laughs> we offer full access to our state-of-the-art technology security. You won't have to relocate from Watson and an attractive career path. Let me know. It's worth it. Uh-huh. All right, bye. Where the cat at? Hi. <laughs> Sorry, that's just gonna make me very happy all the time. Every time I see a cat. Hmm. Your heart chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, yo, listen Anything up. red. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay. Okay. Do my best to talk us up. You enjoy getting your heart chakra realigned, okay? Okay. What do you want, Regina? Listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The Business family. Attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Really enjoyed the anime, by the way. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible two days off a year, <laughs> maybe you can investigate before Max Tap hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Uh -huh. Try to incapacitate the attacker. And I'll On very hard difficulty, corrupt. I'm probably going to be the one getting clear. incapacitated. <laughs> <laughs> All right, incapacitating enemies. There are various ways to incapacitate enemies without killing them. Non-lethal takedowns, non-lethal quick hacks, non-lethal weapons, EMP grenades and some combat gadgets, weapon mods that change damage to non-lethal. If a given weapon, combat gadget or quick hack deals non-lethal damage, it will be mentioned in the description. You got it. Do you truly believe- <laughs> Look, she's taking a picture. <laughs> or recording him, I'm not sure. See, what's going on here? Who's this? A Netrunner? No, that's me being a Netrunner, what? Who is this? Oh, it is a scan results, Netrunner. It is a Netrunner. Uh, NCBD, Netrunning Charge Jump, Sandavistan, and Flashbangs. Okay, I'm just gonna like not look at them. I'm just gonna ignore them. That's my car. Somebody parked it better. Steve the Netrunner. Where are they all running to? What happened? What is happening over there? That stray bullet! Hostile situations. Yeah, no kidding. Who is, what is happening? Who is, who is, what is where? Who that? Who is that? 
We've got Tiger Claws, and I'm guessing NCPD. I'm guessing they're in a fight with the police. Who are you guys? Beat cops. Go, go, go! I I am not involved in this. <laughs> Hi, I'm here to speak to Dex. Just big city stuff. Most extreme elimination challenge. I uh Yo, Miss B. A pleasure. Uh-huh. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Simple indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. I find Dax a really interesting right character. Would you rather live in peace as Miss Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of like, glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your thirtieth? It's hard to say I like him because he's kind of an asshole, but Miss Nobody's don't survive in Night City. You're either somebody or you fizzle out into nothing. Night City don't let you choose. Oh, but it does. See, in my line of work, I choose to be Mr. Chill. But folk who try to take advantage, well, they see the beast inside. All right, listen Then again, close. everyone's an asshole. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab home. I meet me. Hang on, got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Bug sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past. Jackster. Hey, sweet T -bug, help this I love T-Bug. So here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Okay. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech, a biochip to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Hmm. Guessing it belongs to a corp? Mm hmm. Tiger claws, Griffin. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Um. No. Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. I like heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Uh oh. Needs active resolving that. Second, so I do remember this mission. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Okay. Tell me about the client. Client. What's her thing? Why does she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Why would he know mm -hmm. that, Dr. Sparkleman? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> Right, I need anyway, to not mess this up this time. insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. I don't know, I'm kind of only good at the same things as Jaggy's good at. What's the, What's issue? the issue? needs resolving with Maelstrom. Got a beef? I need to not mess this up this time. Slot in the shot. Okay. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. This is so cool. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. Then I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Prime. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. Fucking Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate one Simon Randall, a.k.a. Royce. Royce is an asshole. Ass. I mean, they're all kind of assholes, Royce but... Royce is in charge now. 
and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. Here we go. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said <laughs> convoy. Okay. Royce guy. What's he like? A straight psychopath. Chrome-loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that. Except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Oh, I hate that. Lush. Who's the prima donna? She had the same hairstyle as me. Internal affairs. On my other picture. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. So. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. I masked this up. Of course, up. to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Send it in. The now. way their eyes glow is so cool. Okay, I think I've got everything. Think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flat hey, Beta. Gonna be all How are you? you? Flathead's my job. One more thing, Miss V. Mm hmm Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. All right. So, here's the vibe. When I did this mission on my YouTube playthrough, which was not that long ago, um... Street cred. Performing certain actions will reward you with street cred. Build your street cred to make a name for yourself in the Night City Underworld. Doing so will open up new opportunities. Alright, we need to check that out. I had a problem in that I wasn't 100% clear that the actions I took were going to throw a certain character under the bus. Not to the degree that it happened. And... I don't really remember <laughs> what it was that I did or what it was that I was not supposed to do. So, do we throw Beta under the bus? Absolutely not. Beta's Pathfinder character though, maybe. <laughs> you think you know exactly what I mean? <laughs> I didn't realize that doing what I did was going to throw that character under the bus and then apparently you find that character floating in the river. <laughs> later on and I had no idea <laughs> and I was like and people in the comments were like the wor the only bad decision you've made so far was where you betrayed this character and I was like I me too uh, if it wasn't for Clank we would have no plans okay look we would also have no fireball been thinking of giving that place a look but I'm worried it's full of weirdos what do you reckon chat <laughs> It is full of weirdos, but that's at least half of the joy. I can't believe you'd do this. He could, in fact, believe you'd do this. That's the exact situation you, I thought you meant. I can't remember what it was that I did wrong. <laughs> All right, I want some reflex. I have two attribute points, so I'm going to take two points into reflexes so I can unlock. Oh, baby, lead and steel. We got two perk points. We got to take the ability to block incoming projectiles with blades. Fuck yes. Fuck yes, I have the ability to block incoming projectiles. Let's go. Oh God, Cypher, I respect that completely. I actually spent like uh, two hours yesterday trying to set up my green screen because I thought it'd be really cool to play with a green screen with this game and have like, you know, nothing to interrupt or whatever. I could not get my lighting to work with my new desk set up because I can't mount the light in a place that would make sense. So I could get it perfect if I held the light with my hand. <laughs> That's obviously not very convenient. Be gay, do crime. I will. So I'm I'm going to maybe set it up at some point, but I could not get it working. It was fine. I was there and I don't remember which character it was. Um, You'll meet the character soon and I bet you it'll make you just realize immediately. <laughs> just hold the light time for real life cyberware seriously i actually attached it to the front of my desk thinking that might help but then i couldn't turn my chair so yeah oh yeah my my green screen's back here my elgato one is back there uh and i haven't used it since we moved into this house hi Niberius. just get tea to hold it <laughs> all right we're good so we've spent some points i'm feeling good about it we're going melee focused i'm not sure it's a good idea hey jackie what's up jackster talk to dex 
big deal. Literally a nine. Uh, he was like to work me over. Wants to check us. I see if we got what takes. certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Is that not my car? I guess. Before no, it's not. It's his car. <laughs> he drove There's me. There's this combat bot military prototype. Maelstrom clipped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had to switch up in management. Right. 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 Heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. Hostile takeover. About sums it up. You have two windows both over headlights. Gave the deeds of some Militech agent too, but don't know how much help she stands to be. <laughs> All right. I need to talk to Jackie, and then I need to summarize in my head. You don't sound thrilled, Royce. What do Corpo's you know like him? a corporate business wet. person. Junk. He's a fixer. Okay. Then there's the other thing. Got to meet the client who put the job on the table, Evelyn Parker. Exactly what Machete said. Well, what's Dex gonna do? Hey, Trap, how's it going? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow. Why not? Parker <laughs> wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? <sighs> Gotta start with the client. Parker. Think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. Marale. In that case, I'll hit the all foods and put my nose to the ground. Stick around. Sounds good. Okay, so here's the thing. I need to summarize the job. So, Dax paid for the item, but Maelstrom had a switcheroo in leadership. So, it's unlikely they're going to respect the payment they already received, right? In so far as they don't. <laughs> And there's simultaneously a corpo chick who is very interested in it, the flathead and Maelstrom, for reasons we are not privy to, but she seems desperate. Paying in advance is a rookie mistake. So do they actually... Oh, the journal's completely different now. What the heck? Okay, the information. Go to Lizzie's bar between 6 p.m. So this is for Evelyn. Either Evelyn Parker's got the best intel in town, the biggest pile of scratch, or the brightest goddamn lucky star twinkling over her at night. Fuck, maybe she got all three. Still, good thing Dex sent you to that meet. You clean up better. This goes down right. She'll be a nice new contact for us. And you know the deal. You won't get anywhere without contacts in Night City. So don't fuck it up, Chica. Mox ladies are great. There's a lot of changes. Um, Meredith Stout is the Militech agent. Okay, so call Militech agent Meredith Stout. We should do that after we've done the um, information. Know what I like about your run in the mill gang goons. They know what they like. Cash, sex, power, maybe just the sight of their enemy's blood. Real rays of sunshine they are, but these maelstrom cabrones, shit never can be sure. They look at you with those creepy ass toaster faces and you can't get a read of them. Got no clue what twisted thoughts are racing through their processors. You ask me, that's why biz with maelstrom never turns out pleasant. But sometimes there's just no getting around to it. around it. Let's grab that spider bot, yeah? Make Dax proud. I'm gonna talk to... Evelyn Parker first. And then I think I'm gonna call Meredith Stout. And then I'll meet Jackie. I think. Welcome back, Bubba Rep. Did the upgrade change performance? Mine feels like it looks better and performs about the same. Really love how for 2077 they kept the pattern in the Witcher series where the journal is written in second person from the POV of an NPC close to the protagonist. Yeah, I really like that. All right, so go to Lizzie's bar. What time is this? 4.18 p.m. I reckon I can make it there. Where is the nearest... Fa oh, there's a fast travel right across the street. Why did I call my car? Hey, thought just occurred. A little present. Hey, V, thought just occurred to me. Can't start your career in the major leagues right by sporting some rag of a t-shirt. The wind blows a lot stronger up there on the top of the world. Old timers like me hate to watch you kids catch a cold. Smiley face. Left you a couple of things in your stash of your apartment. Give them an honest try and I bet they'll fit you just right. Um, well, hear me say no to free threads. Victor Vector's typing. I'm beginning to think I should move my camera. Glad to hear it. They were just collecting dust on my closet floor anyway. Much rather give him a good new home rather than sell him for a couple, couple of ennies or trash him. Thanks, bud. Imagine walking. Imagine driving a car. All right. 
fast travel. You go to any fast. Right, so I need to go. This is oh, well, Lizzie's bar. There's <laughs> there's no fast travel that's really close to there. So okay. All right, let's go get in. Anyway, I hope they serve you. Uh, glad to hear they're just collecting dust in my closet floor anyway. Much rather give them to a good new home than sell them for a couple of innings or trash them. Anyway, I hope they serve you well. As they say, style is supreme. Or maybe they don't anymore. I don't know. <laughs> Camera right in the center of the stream. You're right. Wait, hang on. Miss V, I just want to remind you that eddies have already changed hands between me and my esteemed maelstrom partners in Bays. Around some of 10,000 eddies to be precise. So when you're there to take it off their hands, don't let them try to shake you down as they're liable to do. Maelstrom being Maelstrom. Thanks for the info. Couldn't get the rights to call her Meredith Guinness. <laughs> You'll need it. Best of luck. That's true. You don't really need to read the messages. I do though. All right. Maybe I am not going to. Wait, can I? Hang on. How do I radio? Can I? Can I not radio? I thought there was a radio. Here we go. Let's go. I think. Oh, I can't decide. Let's go. I need to go. I need to turn around. Can I U-turn? I don't know. I don't know if I can U-turn. I might just have to go, <laughs> go right the roundabout. I can't see shit. It might actually be easier to drive with a controller, but it's fine. Royal FM's a new one. Okay, hang on. What's the sign like? All right. Let's let's hack and go. I just drove past that car the other direction. <laughs> Excuse me. Ooh, don't worry about it. All right, I'm into it. Drive is easier third person. I agree, but I'm trying to be immersed here. Is this Dexter's car in front of me? Am I like driving awkwardly behind him? Where did you get your license to cereal box? I don't have a license! <laughs> There's Lizzie's bar right there. Excuse me! <laughs> there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm just really short, short, Neo, okay? Why is there so much litter everywhere? Dystopia. Hi. We're closed right now. Oh, yeah, sorry, I was supposed to wait. I apparently took a little less time than I expected, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and. Oops. I'm gonna go ahead and wait. Uh, skip time. I will wait until 6 35. Perfect. Oh, hello. Hi. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I can't do that right now. Okay. Hey there, doll face. Hi. Interest you in a preem BD? Uh, what's good? What do you got? What don't we got? Women and men of your dreams. Synaptic acting A-listers, no washed up virtue porn boy toys or blow up dolls here. Oh, tur stuff. It'll grip your heart and blow your nerves right out of your body. I like Pure it. Your bit-based ecstasy. That's why people come here. Clearly know how to sell it. Not a sales pitch. It's a word. Yeah, that'd be cool, Machete. I'll give you one word. Bespoke. Bespoke. Not for everyone's synapses. Think you can handle it? Another time. You know what? Uh, maybe another time. Sure thing, doll. Thanks. Can I go in? Reconsidered, huh? I just want to go in. Okay. Bespoke. Damn, that sounds promising. I get uh -huh. it. Mm-hmm. Couple of things you need to know first. <clears throat> Severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. I like her hair. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. You got I it. You really look that green deal. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors yep. open. <laughs> Have fun, doll. Thank you. Welcome to Lizzie's. Thanks. My, Hi. What a sweet little face you have. Can I have some of your snacks? Shit. Didn't know that was an option. Hi, Crash. Where are you going? All right, sit at the bar and ask away Avalon. 
You got it. Hey. Snacks and snacks. Get you something. He's cute. Uh. So, curious. The name, Lizzie's. That the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Oh, now I'm just flat interested. Real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. See you later, Zolida. Have a good day. Bar. Thanks for hanging out. Those were paid right, insured, and had decent security. Good spot, all in all. Good old days. I like stories about them. Let me guess. It didn't last. No. Tiger Claws took care of that. Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad once. No hesitation. Lizzie blasted the guy's balls off. Gang came back the next day. Liz was done. Tigers gave this place up to the Mox in the end, though, didn't they? Sort of. The Moxes had to make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. Big boss now is Susie Q. The sign stayed up, out of respect. Biz booms to this Check day. Uh, looking for Evelyn. Looking for Evelyn Parker. <laughs> so Don't not subtle. <laughs> Who's asking? A big tipper. I don't think he cares about that, but fuck it. A big tipper. Generous when I get the answer. <laughs> I don't even have any money. <laughs> Appreciate the gesture, <laughs> truly. But afraid I don't get paid to talk. You're not bothering Opposite, me. Actually. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hello. Drinks? Evelyn Parker. Hi, Evelyn. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Hmm, my tequila of choice. Scent song. Only tequila I drink. How'd you know? How would you know? You're very welcome. I like to Piper. know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Why meet here? Why we meet in here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing, this place. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. All right. Let's go. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. Let's get going. So, what can Lead a on? horny girl like Nothing me wrong. do for really? a hungry guy? Why don't you just tell me the truth? I like the atmosphere of a lot of locations here. What's this? I'm taking it. Sit. Okay. I like her outfit as well. Iconic. It's the last Argonian maid. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional. Uh-huh. Effective. Sure. And trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. Um, you don't care what Dex thinks. You don't give a rat's dick what Dex thinks. <laughs> we both know that. You have trouble accepting compliments? Yes. No, just think <laughs> flattery's beneath you. Am I wrong? Maybe Dex is beneath you. Have you known each other long? No. What are you writing Dex's bio? You writing Dex's bio? Hate to disappoint, but I just don't know much. In other words, you hardly know each other. Yet he fingered you for this job. Hmm. Curious. It is. I don't think she really has doubts about me. Dex right now if you're getting cold feet? I can wait. I don't feel like it's that. I doubt he'd add anything I haven't already heard. Anything I'd really like to hear for that matter. There's only one other bunch that's worse than fixers in that respect. Used car salesmen. <laughs> I'll go with my gut for now. Oh, I get what you mean. <laughs> Let's cut to the chase. He what? <laughs> what do you got for me? They keep saying it. It's, Your I, it's funny to me. Target. I trust you know what it is. Yeah. Bella, secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Yup. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, 
I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Nope. Out of my price range. <laughs> Classic Corp hotels? Mm, yeah, no. Out of my price range. <laughs> that was definitely different for Corpo. The decor's to die for. As you'll see for yourself. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? She's Don't really pretty. The scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to right? the city. Right? The sarcasm. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What, so Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Her voice is so good. So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka himself. <sighs> Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yuri's balls in a vice for years. Unfortunate. He might just turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. He's gonna be well defended. Top dog like Yorinobu's been to have an army on Hi, call. Carrie. I'm good. How are you? probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yorinobu keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Huh. Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. Yeah, I can see that being a problem. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your tits perk up. You leave my tits out of this. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. Cherry blossoms are pretty. He's made a deal with Netwatch, aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? I mean, I'm I'm just a girl. <laughs> so what's Yorinobu slated to get in return? So what's Yorinobu do to walk away with? Unimportant. You focus on the biochip. You perked what up in your What cyberspace's watchers and protectors offer him? Intelligence on his enemies? That doesn't matter in the least. Because you'll make sure the transaction never happens, and I oh, yeah, get the chip. She can talk about my tits all she wants. <laughs> Wait, neutral Netwatch is mixed up in this? Yeah, why? Netwatch provides net security for all corporations and collects eddies in the millions for it. But in this day and age, everyone's in the game and no one can afford to be a saint. To win, one has to go all in. That's pretty much a the theme of this game. Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now where's he hiding it? Ah, my pet well, birds. They're in just a off specialized screen. container, one that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. Uh -huh. And the case is, you'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Oh, this is the brand dance bit, right? One more thing: data that's on the chip. What is it? Irrelevant entirely. We're talking about I data Yorinobu so. snuck out of Arasaka. What's more, he wants to pass it on to Netwatch. Sounds pretty damn relevant to me. Listen, V. Hmm. The relic. That's my concern. Your concern? Earning a paycheck. I wish just that my character could done. just be that I'll ignorant sure and just take the money and go. What else do you know about Yorinobu? Quite a bit, actually. He studied finance and biotech in Tokyo. <laughs> Probably didn't have a choice in the matter, come to think of it. Saburo was grooming him to be his successor. But then Yorinobu vanished to chase his own dreams. Cut himself off from the corp for years. Long story short, though the black sheep returned, the bitter taste remained. But that's only one side of him. There's another. An intelligent man who has always walked his own path. And so has his own designs on the corp. Risky move with the biochip. Seems to be risking everything with this <coughs> relic scam. Yes, because he's fallen for the biggest lie this town puts forward. That he can gain and retain control. 
of anything. All right, let's go. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow okay. me. Got something for you. Sure. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. This is fun. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. <laughs> Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits? Jacking off to in those boxes? No. It can be a very useful Her jacket tool. is very shiny. Good for analyzing uh -huh. details, human perception, even boosted. Doesn't grasp exactly what you need. In fairness, if so I walk... Yeah. Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. If I walk You'll behind her, it seems to walk at her pace. Yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. You mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? So you know him personally. It's supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. It means you were inside. You uh know each other? That's how else could I get all this intel? I know him pretty well, actually. We have an arrangement. An arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Alright. Judy'll help. She's a mox too. <gasps> I Besides, love Judy. We go back. Years. I love Judy. V, this is important. Uh huh. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So you'll be a good girl, tread lightly. I can be a good girl for the right person. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact in biz or life. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Friends, there is an ad coming up. I will do my best to not start anything. <laughs> Hello. I love hey, her. There you are. Oh, I love this her. Is v. She's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. You're gonna make me barf. Ah. Oh, damn. Impressive looking setup. Need all this to process brain dances? Mm-hmm. Analyzers, sensory SIG amps, acoustic and emotive wave monitors, facial expression translators. <coughs> Judy. <laughs> all right, all right. You compiled your beauty yet. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. So we're gonna do a BD. He needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So let's calibrate, tune it to her. Okay. Let's go. Am I gonna have to sit down? Believe me, I've dealt with worse. You should see the jig. I love her. We gotta contend with sometimes. Hana so, was pretty great too. We drop the inside. Let her look. Let her rummage around. Right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? What's so raw about it? <laughs> what do you mean by raw? How's this differ from the ready made Huh. Ready-mades, provided they're well-made, should feed you feelings and impressions you'd never have the chance to experience yourself in real space. But it's mass-market shit, so it's pre-crafted, hard-coded, fenced in, it's and It's a super-wide keyboard. <laughs> a raw one? Well, it's more like a virtue in Viro. Get to move around, look at things in detail. Editors use those layers to fish for juicier emotes and impulses, then use them to pad the BDs that go to market. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. All right, she probably does have a lot of F keys. All right, let's do it. Let's heck and go. Brain dance time. That chair has seen better days. Hiya! I love her. Hello. Hi. I love Judy so much. I love her so much. Got to create your sensory profile first. Okay. Flashing lights time. It's not like it used to be, but there are flashing lights, so A beware. What profile now? Model of your perceptions and emotional responses. You Judy, need to adjust beloved. that so the raw BD won't overwhelm you. If I don't, best case scenario, you'll get nauseous as soon as you're in. Probably barf like you would in a shoddy virtue viral. Mm -hmm. She's she's my in girlfriend. Case, <laughs> your synapses sizzle like locusts in a deep fryer. But we're not about to let that happen. Nah. Profile okay, away. hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. 
our analysis girlfriend comrade. Do? Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. It's okay, Should I can share it slowly. Slight tingling. Mm -hmm. Ooh. This is fine. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sits. Thanks, Rock Cat! Let's smack into these Have a good two day. screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Do this often? Get a lot of requests like this? All the time. But it's usually stuff the girls scroll at the club. I take that and do some routine porn tuning. What a job. Crank up the orgasms? More like cut out all the other shit. Fucking business as usual for these guys. Their minds wander to grocery lists, spouses' birthdays, big <laughs> bills, whatever. But even then, you can refigure things, mold the emotions into something unique, unforgettable. So, I can't complain. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. All right. Okay. All set. I need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Sweet. Now let me see. Where could we... Can't you just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? Evelyn, so chill. So we don't risk our necks? Size won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. It is building so much. Right, okay. <sighs> What'd you choose? Corner store hold up in Haywood. Real amateur. I should probably do the Don't tutorial again. Got it. Suits our needs perfectly, though. You ready? Yeah, go on. Boot it up. Can't remember mm -hmm. everything. It Let has me been that long, but I still can't remember. First. Let you get your bearings, then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in. And, three, two, one. and we're in. Tips on Evelyn. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Got it, got and it. remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Yeah, it's not as bad as it was for sure. They've changed it completely. It was really flashy at the beginning. The main character's called V. So we're playing as V. Down. Everybody, on the ground. I want to see you kissing the flooring. Muddy, now, or I will fucking drop you. I swear to God. Rubik's Cube. Whoa. Yeah. Hey. A uh, Ruby Cubie. Now, before I blow your fucking head off. Yeah, Evelyn's the, our, our informant. Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the He's soft so activated your hormone Take blockers. the cube. Nothing happened. <laughs> You're alive and well. Thank you for the hype train, friends. A flash of intense shock. I can still feel it. I, I remember. Fuck. That last second. Could warn me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about that. You'll be fine. Got everything set up. Let's switch over to editing mode. All right, let's go. This is the thing. This is such a cool feature. I do feel like it was underutilized. I'll sever the link to the <gasps> so BD weird. Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. <coughs> All right, cool. The orbs. Full cam so. control and analysis mode. So move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. Cool. So analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Yeah, same. Then you use the editor Cultist, console sure. to unpause. Try it. Okay. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go. He kind of his voice kind of reminds me of Nathan Fillion. Out, and we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Press and hold Q to rewind. Rewind. Roll it back to the top. Should I get up? All right, back to the beginning. All good, neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing off the screen. This is so funny. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Hold R. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. Okay. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan. It sounds like it, right? Viral recorded by the BD roller. <clears throat> Focus on the heat. The gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Okay. Scan it. 
You can only scan a clue during moments when it's perceivable by the person recording the brain dance. Okay. Play. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the so studio. He gets the gun. Got it, got it. And remember, gives him the gun. On full blast. They'll Come spot on, dude. An extra for a week. Did he already give him the gun? No. Dude, hurry up. I could fast forward, okay. but. On you go. Here you go. Come on, go, 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 go. Okay, there we here. go. Bold sections of the track indicate a scannable clue. The clue will be highlighted for the duration of the sequence if the editor is set to the correct layer. Clues may overlap each other. The spot where they overlap in the recording track will be especially bright. After being successfully scanned, clues disappear from the track. Excellent. There we go. Let's move on. Okay. Now heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To okay. see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, we're going to the audio layer. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures uh -huh. in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Okay, we got a sign source here. Okay, fuck! On you go! Ah, little shitheads! Go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? <laughs> so, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously, like it was happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. I love the way she says makes them pop. Keep playing with the sounds, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Okay, so... Alright, we don't have anything there. We do have this, though. Brosis. Okay, we have a deal today on two flavors. Cody and no. Surf and Turf. <laughs> right. Okay. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller's cyberware picked up. Like what? Like what? <laughs> Ed's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat like what? from her recording. Huh. Hella nice. Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. A mince pie already? Uh -huh. Holy crap. What a shit gets in the flooring! Money! Scanning works on peeps too. Okay. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. Alright, next thing. Store customer Scroll unconscious. To the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah, hey! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! Then... See that? Shot it's right there. And he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. I do think this is super cool. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance camera. Yeah. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screens and the kids feel okay. the vision. Then scan it. Back we go. Screen. Neat. And it shows you the cam. That's cool. Zooms in on. It's Joomba! It's to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. So gross. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. I think that's all we need. <coughs> Back out of the BD. I really did think they were going to use brain dances yeah, a lot more. It's impressive, right? Too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Not flogging the log. Anyway, Hi, Malik, how this? are you? Look at your wreck. I don't know. I. Ugh, let's take a break. <gasps> Hi, Gabs, so like how are you? Everyone. Congrats on Ambassador. <sighs> yeah, I think I'm done. Good to see you. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Go ahead. Just need T Buck to link in. I'm doing really whoa, well, whoa, thank whoa. you. Who? Runner for my crew. T Bug's Security the best. Specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we <laughs> analyze. Fuck, no problem. problem I hope. Yeah, Actually, me either, Fluffy. It is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Judy, T Bug's a professional, discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Cause you say so? Yeah. Please, Judy. 
I love Judy, though. I'd never expose you to any danger. You know that. Okay, B. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. I call T-Bug. I love T-Bug. So glossy. Hey, She's that? glossy. Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Conpecky Plaza. It's a brain dance. Conpecky? Oh, I thought as much. Someone there with you? Unimportant bug. Please focus. Need your help. Got no clue what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> Bastard only chap. You can't see your badge, right, Barry. So <laughs> Jacking it to your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request. Judy is not now. happy. Got it. You ready? Bug listen is such a fun thing to say. Okay. Connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice and we're clear. Ready to dance. I Fire love dancing. Judy. <laughs> Why does Barry always flex on us scraps? <laughs> Hi Aromia, how are you? Good morning. They did change the UA. Eyes open. Got Here we go. Out where you're no who's keeping the relic. Okay. Now we're Evelyn. Smash! You look like a cut of fuckable meat. Yes! Yes! <laughs> she... I felt her fear. Smash. Sure got it Smash. under control quick, too. I said no. I'm sorry. <laughs> Best line. Okay, back to work. How did he know? Oh, dear. I shouldn't like Adam Smasher. I should not like Adam Smasher. Adam Smasher is a problem. <laughs> To be clear, I don't like him. He's a dick in every way. But also, <laughs> I have a problem. <laughs> My roomie just finished reinstalling Cyberpunk. Something was wrong with his install and he had to remove it totally and reinstall from scratch. Oof. Ouch. The UI for that used to use the same prompt as when an enemy Netrunner targets you. So just say enemy quick hack in progress. I love that. But Smash is in his name. No passing here. No, exactly. Smash the Smash. He's a problem. I can fix him, Max. Or maybe I can make him worse. <laughs> I'm eighty-eight percent sure he can no longer smash. Uh, if he had a better personality, I would. I mean, as is, still would. But I would, would. <laughs> <laughs> He's such a dick, but also, is it hot in here? <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's a clip of Robbie encountering Adam Smasher in this scene where it says, you look like a cut of fuckable meat. And she's like, ooh. <laughs> and I completely forgot that the line existed. <laughs> oh my God. It is very cool to see him in game. Have my hair for this. <clears throat> then you shall perish for I'm watching cause. the whole thing. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute. Listen in on that conversation, B. Could be something important. Okay, look, I'm not actually done yet, so whatever. Yet? Actually, let's go to the beginning. Pew. All right, visual mode. Here we go. Military grade cyberware detected. Cybernetic modifications, 96%. Danger extreme. Warning, extreme caution advised. That doesn't affect me because I can't read. <laughs> we got a motion sensor camera. Shit, camera's packed with new tech. You just want to hear him say it again. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. All right. Can't read, only smash. Alarm system? Alarm primary is <laughs> fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. <laughs> Something about lots of seeds falling to this sieve. Queenie, don't worry about it. Right <laughs> their six. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Have you played Cyberpunk before? <laughs> Because this guy just said, you look like a cut of fuckable meat. And it says, extreme caution advised. That doesn't affect me. I can't read. <laughs> they didn't say there were any red flags. 
Uh, okay, we good. Oh my god, hi! Hi, CD Project Red. How are you? Oh my god. You guys, did you just walk in? No! Wait, I just realized! <laughs> did you just arrive when I said that? <laughs> Please, no! <laughs> this is the worst day of my life! <laughs> <laughs> I need to leave. <laughs> I stopped by it. <laughs> Why does this always happen to me? <laughs> Barry, thank you for gifting us up to see Project Red. Oh no. <laughs> Amazing! How you doing? <laughs> we started a fresh playthrough today. <laughs> All right, you this is fine. Like a oh my God! Not in front of CD Projekt Red. <laughs> no more coffee for you. That is fair. All right, we have audio. I said no. I have my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. Here in a drone, ventilation and cooling. Servers. I stand by the Not decision. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. I'm not going to make a lewd comment about that. <laughs> it happens to you because you're always like this. You're not wrong. So, CDPR, how you doing? <laughs> Welcome in. <laughs> Sorry for the immaculate timing. <laughs> make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. Okay. Can we scan this? I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Okay. Please speak the day. with your father. He's taking so a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's a tired, visionless old graybeard. Not the graybeard. Who thinks nothing will change. And he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck Walk in over some here. Fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists, of a world that may never have existed. He's an angry man. We have not seen eye to eye for the past twenty years. I am quite sure we won't now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific oh, she's sitting down now. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Not right. In Heard that? Relic docs got to be around here somewhere. Okay. Cool. Look for them. For anyone who's wondering, I did actually play through this fairly recently on YouTube. Uh, but I have the memory of a goldfish. Well, apparently, goldfish memories are not that bad. But I, I do have a short memory. And there are things that have happened in this playthrough that already I don't remember. Yes, the DLC is like tonight at midnight. I'm still conflicted. So I was originally going to play the DLC on my playthrough I was already doing on YouTube. And I was just going to do Fandom uh, Liberty here on Twitch instead. But so much has changed that snap decision over the weekend. I was like, let's just start again on Monday. <laughs> Goldfish is nine seconds. I thought it was three, but I think it's actually not that bad. I think they actually can remember a lot longer. Hi, Osric. For several months? Okay, that's even longer than I thought. Also called Teflon memory, nothing sticks. That's me. 7 p.m. my time, it comes out. You're counting the hours. That's exciting. It's midnight my time. Got into Cyberpunk on tabletop over a decade ago. My ST friend passed last year. Oh, but Cyberpunk was his favorite system. I think of him all the time when I play now. Oh, Aromia. That's, I mean, it's that's sad, but also it's nice that you have that connection, you know? Research has shown that goldfish can remember objects for weeks. Okay, my memory isn't even as good as a goldfish's. <laughs> what does that mean? No! <laughs> That's terrible! <laughs> Alright, let's continue. Uh, sorry to make you wait. Business can be stupid. Yeah, that's fair. It wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Oops! Is everything alright? You seem tense. I didn't mean to like. A moment. It will pass. <sighs> I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus. 
on me. Right. This is visual. What are we looking at here? What do we see? Oh, we see that. An automated turret. That's automated the thing. Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. System is all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? 100% agree, no pixelated wonder. <laughs> Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Okay. Mm -hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to That's shut fair. down That's fair. That's what systems. we're doing next. It's fine. Can't get around them ourselves? Nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. Okay. Now we need to scan his data pad while it's turned on. last time. Good one. Nice then. I've got an idea. Be right back. Right? Now wait, hang on a second. What's she doing here? Romantic. She's Very reading nice, his messages. But come here already. The penis Just a gel. Sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Angelica Meloti Clouds, your time in the clouds. Dear Mr. Arasaka, as always, we thank you for using our services. We hope Clouds was able to make your stay in Night City more pleasant, unforgettable even. We'd be honored to serve you again. Interesting. I don't think I ever uh, saw that before. You'll like this. So, again, we can go into editing mode, and then what are we scanning here? Is it just the TV? Oh no, it's over here. Okay. Uh, you'll like this. Okay, let's get closer. Loaded. Safety's on. That's the gun. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Okay. And then we need to look at his... Pause! Let's look at that. The data pad. Manual details a special tip-controlled container. Okay. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So Chip's got to stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Okay, cool. Should be didn't know you could go first person in these. I didn't mean to, but I'm glad I did. <laughs> okay, thermal. I think we're going to need to go back a bit, right? There's something here. What are we looking for? What's this? What is it? Oh, that. Up there. Air conditioning. Standard model for hotels of this caliber. Okay. Tip matches that stipulated in the docks, but no way the chip's hiding there. Too risky. Tip fluctuations. Makes sense. Risk of damage. You could bug out this mission going into thermal before the game wanted you. If you scanned the target before T-Bug told you to, it would soft lock. I didn't know that. I once did that with a game called... Oh Did anyone play Uplink? I played a game called Uplink and I bought the thing that you were supposed to buy, but I bought it before the game told you to. So it bugged and then I didn't have enough credits left to buy it whenever it told me to. Oh, Donna Geese. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No. No way. Tim's too low, could fluctuate. Nice try though. Okay. It was such a good game. That's the game where uh, my ex thought that I was actually hacking. <laughs> he was like, how do you know you're not hacking the FBI? And I was like, I don't know, because I'm just a girl. <laughs> and it's a video game. Just a fancy ass fridge. Just a fancy ass fridge. Won't find a thing here. This bit. What are we looking at here? Oh, over there. A hidden safe. Right. Grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Your Nobu's got the case here. Guaranteed. Makes sense. Mm-hmm. We've got it. Hack Good the work. Planet. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. Okay. I think we got everything. I don't think there was anything we missed. Just for old time's sake. <laughs> okay, I'm done. <laughs> Get everything you need? Yep, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. I'm not today. sorry. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. 
You were never here. He doesn't need it, better. <laughs> Hi, Judy. You should make that sound by the red alert. I might get banned. <laughs> Oh, hi. I'll put it on Ev's tab. They love her so much. <laughs> Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Thanks. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Smart. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? A kind of fuckable me? <laughs> fucking corpses. Sorry. We needed that recording, Judy. BD practically does our job for us. <laughs> the BD will be the death of us. Seriously. If Arasaka finds out you have it, you're dead. I'm dead. Judy, relax. No one will ever Nobody know. Nobody will ever know. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. Yeah, Evelyn. You go that route. City will always She's be. right, though. So be careful. She's right. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. His puree setting? <laughs> the squeaky chair in my pants. I love Judy. Can I, can I? No. Oh, wait. One sec. Thanks for the help. Thanks, Judy. Really. And don't worry. I know what I'm doing. Do I? I like how she's like, I am not talking to you. <laughs> Hello. Let's walk. Okay. We walking and talking. Oh my god, Bella. Well, what do you think? Connection to Yuri Nova. What's its nature? I have absolutely no place to be speaking. I think I see how you know so much about Yuri Nobu. It's simple. Men like Pillow talk a bit too much. So it's just about the sex. Biz. Sure, Machete. Biz only. You sure he doesn't suspect anything? You're sure Yorinobu doesn't expect this kind of move from you? He's got no idea. Trust me. He's too busy with Netwatch to give me that kind of attention. Besides, even if some suspicion takes root in his mind, it shouldn't matter. He won't react in time. And that's something you'll handle, right? Uh-huh. Sure. Not afraid they'll tie you to the heist? not worried. Arasaka will flag and screen anyone who's had dealings with Yorinobu. Oh, they'll have a long list then. Packed full of big names. Much That is the benefit of kind of hiding you in plain sight, right? Who they check first. Corpo hotshots and cutthroats. Who actually have or something a against him? Plaything like me. Intel on Yorinobu, the chip, the BD from Kentucky. So this is Avalon. When's a right? Plan's perfect. A job like this comes one in a million. Hmm. Thanks. Now the punchline, please. Just sounds too good to be true. What's the catch? Cold feet. Are you looking to get out of it? I want to know if you're no really way, in really, Michelle. Here, that you're not sending me into That's the funny. sort of shit I can't wait out of. V, I have zero reasons to haze you. We're in this together, really. Trust me that I got this. <laughs> Kiki, not Adam Sandler. <laughs> so. What now? V. Hi, Medic. How are you? Do this job for me. I mean, me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. You want to haze our fixer? You want to fuck over our fixer. I knew something was up. Dex is a middleman. And a useless one at this point. Evelyn, you don't mess with fixers. That's the one rule every merc in this city knows and actually BK do crime. But if we're smart, doesn't matter. A mistake like that'll cost you your rep. And without a rep, you're nobody. You sure you want to do this? Better ask yourself that question. Do you want to spend the rest of your days blasting scabs or become a Everyone legend always promises me to become a legend overnight. Your choice. Gang crimes, I'm in. I'll think about it. If I agree. Did you all go to the dentist pay, today? For sure. <laughs> I know. Whatever you decide, it stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. 
Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. So... Okay. Good luck. Thanks. Now go. Ding, ding, ding! a few words with Judy. Okay, you do that. I have a question. My question is, without telling me what it was... Oh my god, you got her number. I did. Without telling me what it is... Is it really bad if I side with Evelyn? Because I think I've always done the... I, you can't really call it the goody two-shoes thing because is anything really goody two-shoes in Cyberpunk in Night City? I think I always went to Dex. Is it possible? Like, d is it really bad if I don't? Is it really bad if I side with Evelyn? Can we marry Evelyn? Well... Definitely, maybe. I haven't gone to Evelyn. I don't know. Neither option is worse. So I kind of want to go to Evelyn. I can safely say you can try it and see without a problem. Well, so I have the knowledge of what happens with the Dax line anyway. And honestly, <laughs> I don't really feel like siding with Evelyn is necessarily going to make that much of a difference. If you know what I mean. <laughs> If you know, you know. <laughs> so. Just live together and get a cat. Like, if you know, you know. I just recently played this through on my YouTube and I didn't get very far. I got to the just before the Voodoo Boys quest line, which is why <laughs> such a bummer. This, uh, so um, Phantom Liberty is coming out tonight slash tomorrow. It's tonight at midnight. Um, and. I am at the precise point that apparently, like, once I finish the quest line I'm on in my Corpo playthrough on YouTube, I was ready to do Phantom Liberty. But so much has changed, and I honestly didn't like being Corpo, that I feel like starting new was good. So <laughs> I can get pretty far. Like, I could probably get to that quest line this week and then do Phantom Liberty. I don't know. I guess I'll see what happens. Try something new. Maybe we will. Call Dax. No, don't Oh, hello? How things looking, Miss V? I got the Compeki recording. Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki. We're here for terrible decisions. You can save scum. Beautiful. T -bug already but time-wise? Said she's working her magic. And the flathead? Nothing yet. On it now. T-Bug says no chance at that chip without that bot. To work then, Miss V. All right. I'm street kid. <laughs> Meet with Jackie, call Militech. We're gonna call Militech Agent Meredith Stout, but first I would like to get the heck out of here. Hi, friends. Hello, everyone. I think I came this way, right? Hola, V, how's it going? What's the status? Met with a client, played me a BD of the place we're supposed to visit. I'll let you know later, Jack. I don't think it's safe to text. Bueno, looking forward to this. Okay. <laughs> Capitalism is best served cold. First will come the great reality check, which ushers in the future of the world. Shut up. <laughs> okay, I have a level up. That's the wrong button. You were a corporate and you didn't love it. It made me feel like an asshole. Like the options I got to say in conversations, like there was one in uh, the Compeki Plaza start where you can be an absolute dick to the receptionist. And I felt like such an ass. And I know that the, like my character literally says, you know, this is what corpos would say. And I'm just trying to play the part. The new perk layout is very overwhelming, but I do think it's more, um, more, like, I'll show you what I mean. I think it's more understandable now. Like, it's more intuitive, if that makes sense. So, I don't know what I want here. I've taken this. I kind of want to level up some of these. Like, this is more intuitive to me. So, this is the baseline here. I need stunt jock. New ways to exit vehicles. Jump out, double tap F. Slide out, hold F while at high speed. You can also draw and fire weapons during these stunts. While driving, no bullet spread penalty for movement and minus 50% bullet spread overall. I love all of this stuff, but I thought this was really important. Um, seeing double, increased damage and stun chance with counterattacks. Bullet deflect. When your stamina is above 33%, blocking projectiles will deflect them to wherever your radical is aimed. While timed blocking just before being hit increases the damage you deal with deflected bullets. That is so cool. 
and this here flash and thunderclap when performing strong attacks you now automatically leap to enemies within range these leap attacks can also be performed from midair and deal additional damage that scales with the distance of the leap holy crap so what does this do dash um minus 20 percent stamina cost for dodging and dashing unlocks the ability to dash press left control to perform a dash dashing replaces dodging allowing you to cover more ground and automatically vault over low obstacles so how does it look okay interesting left control nothing will get past my bow i have to share this with you brady and i played this has become a thing that has stuck with both of us we played a game of overwatch and there was a person in in our team who said nothing will get past my bow and then he picked genji now if you have any understanding of overwatch genji does not have a bow genji has a katana Kenji does not have a bow. The same guy immediately fell off the map. <laughs> I think about him often. <laughs> I think about him often. <laughs> also, what, Brad, was that the same guy who... Um, our other healer started picking on him and saying, oh my God, I don't believe you have no kills. And he immediately started attacking me for no reason. I was like, leave me the fuck out of it. Why did he drag me into their argument? I hadn't said a single thing. One of those in most competitive matches. Some say he's still falling to this day. I think that was the next match. The actual Hanzo. Oh, I think you might be right. <laughs> Nothing will get past my bow. <laughs> incredible incredible the one who said i'll get the healers and then oh yeah that's right he was a guy who was like i don't worry i got it i'll take care of the healers and then just kept dying <laughs> did you play the there's an overwatch dating sim excuse me i don't know what i want to take i'm gonna have a look at the perk trees for cool as well so cool gives me feline footwork when crouched oh my god kiki when crouched, plus 15% movement speed, plus 15% mitigation chance. It's the Kiki tree. I'm in this game. <laughs> you are. Mitigation grants a chance to reduce incoming damage by current mitigation strength. Default 50%. It's canon. Um, small target. Okay, I actually really like this. And then we get Road Warrior. Allows you to use Sound of Vista and to slow time while driving. Allows... Horenzikov to be activated while aiming and handbreaking simultaneously. Oh man, driving's gonna be so cool. Killer Instinct, plus 25% damage with knives, axes, and silenced guns outside of combat. They also provide preview of estimated damage. Oh, I like it. I'm gonna take feline footwork. I think that's gonna be handy. Oh, and I also have an attribute point now. To unlock this, I need to get this to nine. So this has focus, only affects pistols, revolvers, precision rifles, and sniper rifles. And then this is only affects throwable weapons. I want that. So we're going to need to take a point in cool. Oops. So I'm going to keep these two relatively balanced. Oh my god, Kiki, you have to do, you have to do it. It's a browser game, not sure if it's still available. It was for Valentine's. Oh, gotcha. Okay stealth melee build i don't think it's gonna go very well but i like the idea i can throw knives from afar and then when i get into combat i can just slash the crap out of them hell yeah all right cool 4 a.m last night Jim yeah. and me sitting at the bar and meet with oh i need to call her i'm gonna call her from my side this is fine i will say that so this is a very different game to starfield for example starfield is very like open world sandboxy do whatever the fuck you want and you could do whatever you want in night city but i appreciate the fact that in this game there's a lot more story like very very exposition heavy but it's still story where's gerald i bet you we can find gerald um i need my phone i'm gonna call how do i there we go i'm gonna call meredith stout By telling me how you got this number. Damn, thank you for gifting no two more subs. Than your number. Enjoy your sniper you rifle. A convoy. You shut him up. She's mad. Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Let's meet up. Cut a deal. No, not on the horn. Not on the Let's horn. Meet. Cut a deal. A deal. Fine. 
First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm channel under the overpass. Meet you there. You got it. Okay, meet with the Militech agent or meet with Jackie. I think we'll meet with the Militech agent. So here's the thing. I have a question. But first of all, Dem, thank you so much for gifting two subs to the community. I appreciate it. If you just got gifted a sub by Dem, please enjoy your emos. Feel free to stop people your, your tentacles? Your tentacles. With consent. That's why they're called consentacles. Is that a gun that looks like a penis? I don't know. Um, it's distracting me anyway. Whenever I screwed Meredith over... Where, at what point did I screw her over? Was it when I did the thing in front of her under the bridge? Or was it when I did the thing in the Maelstrom base? Which point was it? Is that a penis gun? Because it looks like a penis gun in the top up here, up there. It was in the base. It's where I did the thing in the base, right? So if I use the, the chip, I can still clean the chip, but if I use the chip, that's when it screws her over. <laughs> Arrows, no. Okay, so I can still clean it if I wanted to. I feel like I moved slower than I did before. Should I drive? Where's my car? I think I left it out here. Yeah, it's parked really awkwardly here. Let's have a look at the map. So this is meet with the Militech agent. This is meet with Jackie. I'm going to meet with the Militech agent. Not that kind of replacement. Oh! <laughs> this has been a bad stream for that, Eros. I swear. <laughs> nice parking. Um, It's not that bad, actually. Ignore the fact that the front wheel is in the wrong place. <laughs> oh, damn, I'm so sorry. I'm glad you're here. I appreciate that. Thanks for being here. I'm sorry that it's been difficult to find streamers that you feel comfortable with. I hope you feel comfortable here. Is the agent hot? Which one? The lady? That's a sidewalk. Okay. Do y'all not park? Do you not? Okay, I'm sorry. You're American. <laughs> you don't park like that. When we park in this country, you park on the curb. Slightly. Like up on the curb. That's a thing here. Like you, you park half of your car on the curb. That doesn't make it right. Get out of my house. <laughs> we only because we have thin roads. We do. We have very small roads. It's true. In Ireland, the streets are one meter wide. It's true. <laughs> also, yes, everyone's welcome at the campfire except fucking turfs. They can get out. That doesn't make it legal either. <laughs> we don't do that on the curb because it impedes people using it, like people with accessibility issues. So we actually have wider paths. We have thinner roads. Does that make sense? Although I'm going to be honest with you, a lot of pavements here are not accessible. You're absolutely right. Not only do they park on the curb, they park on either, both at the same time. All right, I need to go. I'm gonna drive. That sucks, Gogs. I, I, don't worry about it. Don't, don't worry about it. Don't, don't worry, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> okay. Where am I supposed to turn? Here? I think so. It's fine. Am I driving all over the road? Yeah. Do the cars feel nice to drive? A little bit, but would you fucking drive? I don't have road rage. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> oh, wait. I think I was supposed to go up that way. Don't mind me. It's fine. You have the rage part time. <laughs> oh, this is such an awkward way to have to go. Can people just get out of my way and then we're fine, okay? Do I have a horn? Don't answer that question. I'm horny all the time. <laughs> God damn. Look, okay. Shut up. It could be worse. I could be April. 
<laughs> Yelling at that Tesla driver. <laughs> Yeah, April just yelling out our open window. Hey, asshole! That thing next to your steering wheel, it's called a turn signal. Use it! <laughs> All right, here we go. And before I meet her, actually, no, we'll meet her anyway. Solu, could you do me a favor and delay, snooze the ads if they pop up? When the three minutes pops up, because I want to make sure I've done this conversation first. That music was a little bit extra. Hi. Look lively. Me or Meredith them? Stout. Take it you were the one to call. Yep, that's me. Uh, got a proposition for got you. Got an offer for you. Excuse me. She offered me her hand, asshole. Oh, you could blackmail me, bitch. Set conditions. <laughs> I forgot that she's such a dick. Got any more for me? Calm the fuck down. I just want to talk. I thought he was holding a grenade for a second. Christ, Meredith. Shut your trap. That fucking thing ready? All set. Now she answer my hot. questions. Honestly, forthrightly. Are you here alone? Yeah. Yep. <clears throat> Just little old me. <laughs> Mommy, sorry. It's the truth. Oh, are you scanning me? Do a sweep now. She's so paranoid, you can tell. Now listen, folks. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? Julian Adams. I don't know him. That guy? Never seen him before. Sam VA is Misty? Sure, sure. What? Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... Ugh. Her, you can let go. Smash. <laughs> what she has to say. He's hot. She's hot. Couldn't have been chill from the start. Shut the fuck up. Tell me what you want. You tell me, mommy. I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point a finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment, so I could go that route too. I think but that was chill for her. But on one condition. You pay with our money. Okay, so Okay. Sounds solid enough. I'm in. Some shards you find in the world will contain information hidden behind data encryption measures. To decrypt a shard, first either open it through the notification when you acquire it or find it later in the shards tab under journal in the main menu, then click and select crack security to unlock its secrets. You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to fuck me in any way, and I'll be seeing you real soon. All right. So. You're making a mistake. I hate him. Cubs are any good at dead. But she'll take you down with her. Bye. The game where a lot of NPCs make you go, they're awful people, but oh no, they're hot. So here's the deal, right? You can fuck her over. Uh, yes, I'm waiting this time. I immediately went in. So... <sighs> that dude isn't gonna be in Cyberpunk 2. He sure was in my Corpo playthrough. I should have gone to the shards menu. Hold on. Is it in here? There we go. Uh, encrypt it. So... I do. I do. I want to know. Well, okay. Actually, more specifically, rather than telling me how not to fuck her over. If I do, if I crack the security on this card, I cannot use it then. Right? Because that will fuck her over. So I either have to pay with her card without cracking the security or not pay with her card at all. 
Is that correct? I think you can crack it in two different ways. I think one of them is to crack the security to get the info and one is to clean it. And I think cleaning it is the problem. I cleaned it and then paid with it and bad shit happened. <laughs> Now, I am going into this with prior knowledge, so I, I realize that I'm metagaming a little bit here, but I figure I should do things a little bit differently to what I did last time. So I am going to... You can spell it out a little bit. It's okay. I've done this mission twice, and I did the exact same fucking thing both times, apparently. <laughs> did I mean to? No! But I just did. I have this really terrible, terrible habit of acting before I think. And with that, actually, the ads are supposed to start shortly anyway. I need to take a super short bathroom break. So I'm going to run the ads. It's Mass Effect all over again. I'm going to manually run the ads. And go to the bathroom. Actually, they might, they might run once I'm done talking, so I'll leave that. Screw the corporate biznatch. Yeah, but dogmatic one. There's another corporate biznatch ready to follow her up. It's Mass Effect all over again. So excited to pick up my playthrough again tomorrow. So I totally forget all of my choices, literally. You can either crack it and keep and blast your way through without paying for the flathead at all, or you can give them this shard. Okay. So either don't pay for it at all and kill everybody or give them the shard. I did the same as you previously with the logic of I'm playing a street kid. Do I want to piss off Maelstrom or Militech? Militech it is. Yeah. See, I feel like I should do something different this time, but I feel like my corpo should have done the other thing. Do you know what I mean? Maybe I should just clean this and then shoot everybody. So if I crack it and shoot everybody, we're good, yeah? I am going to die, though, because I am indeed playing on very hard difficulty. <laughs> Militech is, it is, think of the XP from that menace. Oh, I don't know. I'll tell you what. I'm going to go to the bathroom. I'm going to be running some ads. Don't worry, you're not missing anything. I promise. I've done a full save, so we can come back if I mess everything up. I'll be back here in a second. Just, just saying very hard, I had to go away from punching for a small time here. <laughs> I'm not surprised. I'm going to go have a bathroom break. Uh, we'll have a bathroom breakthrough. I'll see you back here in a few minutes, okay? I feel like it's really pretty. I don't know if they changed. I changed a couple of my settings, but it does look prettier and it performs really well. <laughs> of course, there's a clip. <laughs> okay, encrypted Militech data shard. Let's have a look at the security on this. I've forgotten. Also, can you remember how long it took me to figure out how to do this? Neutralize the malware, removes the malware infecting the shard, or copy the malware, makes a copy of the... So... I don't know if they're still here. That's okay. That's okay. I don't feel like I really need to do this. Because this seems like a like this seems like I'm essentially intentionally going against Meredith's Dite. Why would you copy the malware if you weren't also going to neutralize it? Do we screw over Meredith Stout or not? I love how this sounds like so time sensitive. Screw everyone. So in my heart of hearts, I feel like killing everybody makes the most sense for my street kid. However, I'm also a little bitch. <laughs> and I'm playing on very hard which I'm scared of. If you copy it, you get a quick hack. Ah, okay. Then B, D, B, D, F, F, five, five. All right, I'm happy with that. I'm not gonna clean it. I'm not gonna clean it. Property of Militech, unauthorized access is strictly prohibited. Did that work or was I supposed to disable it as well? I can't see. Did I have to clean it as well? Hey look, it's my car. 
So he's up just up ahead. Let's go. Okay. That's not how you get out of here. Never mind. I want. Full power! Let's go! <laughs> Up the ramp! Oh! Whoops! It's fine. It's fine. You can make it. <laughs> I don't think I can. It's how frantically my character seems to be spinning the steering wheel. This sounds a little tooly, don't you think? So big. Not anymore, it doesn't. What way are you taking me? What route is my GPS taking me? It's impressive that it legit feels like a city. Yeah, for sure. I think I'm going down there. Driving feels better than it did in thingy before 2.0. Oh well, there's a war happening there, it's fine. No biggie. You crashed so much because you were headbanging to the music. I love it. Wish the map was clear. The map is so confusing vertically, absolutely. Completely agree. Let's go. My cat is about to make issue. Do you mind? <laughs> Come on, dude. Drive faster. It couldn't be much worse, to be honest. It was pretty bad. People in the comments were like, oh my god, you're so bad at driving. And I was like, okay, but like, have you driven in this game? <laughs> it's hard. Uh, All right. Hey, Jackie. I'm gonna just park. Oh, there you are. It's a great parking job. Don't talk about it. See you later, Cipher. Enjoy. And thank you for leaving the tab open. I appreciate Let it. Let me hear what you squared away. It does feel a bit wobbly. Been waiting long? My mother always said patience pays off, so. It's the word in T-Bug. T-Bug show any sign of life? You two talk? I think they'd all be self-driving by now. up to date. Fired up to work with Dex. Preparing already. I drove in third person most of the time, so Jenny. Worked together before Dex took his break. Alright. So Dex already paid the mail strummers for the Corpo bot. They're not gonna respect that. Can't be sure the gang goons are still willing to hand it They're not gonna hi Oisin, how are you? You paid up front? Well, whatever. My car is causing issues. You scheme yet? You got a plan? Right. I don't have the money to buy it. We have the mail attack. I'm just gonna say I doubt this will go smoothly. Hello. Doubt shit. Oh, I hope you feel better soon, Oisin. This is Maelstrom. Gang world ain't too complicated. Might's right. The strong survive. Either you fuck others, or you get fucked. Right, we are going to die here. So, into the Borg beast den. Let's do it. Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. Okay. See if they even open up. Quick saving. This is gonna be rough. Oh my god, get over it. It's the tiniest right. little bit of car. <laughs> Just had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? I take the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Oh no, what's Rick? I hope you feel better. Go on, let them know we're here. Hi. <sighs> Don't know you. Hey, Dum Dum. Want to talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. All right. So we have two 
turrets, but they're gonna leave me alone. Uh, I love Jackie. Cozy place. They could use a few plants, though. <laughs> oh yeah. They look damn well prepared. Sniper ammo Don't that I'm I've never gonna take. Seen security like this in the a future of meat. Mm. Uh, gear from the Jack convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. I'm still not That's sure what I'm gonna do. All right. Psycho boards chromed out with military grade hardware worth millions. This should be fun. Oh, at least they turn off. I was like, are they gonna, you know? Ooh, I got a hoodie! Nice. Actual meat or printed meat? I can't do anything with those. I think it's synth meat. <laughs> Yummy, my favorite. <laughs> what are we gonna do? Somebody help me. I don't know what to do. Right, I need your opinions. What would a street kid do? Knowing what I know. Yes, your mom. <laughs> I fucking hit it here. Shoot them all in the face? Yeah, you're right. But I, yeah, I kind of like Dum Dum. Do you know T got a bug the first time he played? T bug. <laughs> T got a bug where for like how much of the game? Like 10 plus hours, Dum Dum was stuck following him. Yeah, he helped. He got into cars. He fought for him. Dum Dum stuck with him. <laughs> they were bros. For a really long time. <laughs> and he just didn't come with you? Aww. <laughs> I think we broke up. <laughs> I don't see a problem. Everyone fucking hates males from there. They're the worst. But Dum Dum though. Dum Dum companion. Pa so T literally apparently. They were driving around. They were fighting people. And then one day he drove off and Dum Dum didn't get in the car. That's not a no, bug. That's not, friendship. Not oh, you got out of the car and he drove off. and <laughs> Fair. He stole your car and then you never saw him again. <laughs> One good apple doesn't unspoil the barrel. Yeah, but then don't I have to kill? What would I? What would, what would a street kid do for the maelstrom gig? I don't want to fuck over Meredith again. I've done that twice. The first time because I wasn't paying attention and I got a prompt. So I just hacked the chip. The second time because I wasn't paying attention and I got a prompt and hacked the chip. <laughs> Yeah, so you paid with the chip. Yeah. Cyrus, thank you for gifting two subs to the community. I appreciate it. Enjoy your sniper rifle. I know it's Maelstrom. Dum Dum's long con for a car. <laughs> Went from Dum Dum to Dumped Dumped. <laughs> Do the other route to sate your curiosity. Either route works. Either killing everybody or paying with the card. Yeah, I don't think I don't think a street kid would pick a fight with Maelstrom. I don't think they like Maelstrom, but I don't think they would necessarily pick a fight with Maelstrom because they know Maelstrom are major players. So I feel like, yeah, street kids hate corpos, but realistically speaking, if you get rid of her, you end up with probably a worse corpo. I know I'm mad at gaming right now. <laughs> you would do what it takes to save your own skin. I don't know, he seems pretty smart, smart to me. I feel like both are equally plausible. On one hand, almost no one likes Corpos. On the other hand, almost no one likes Maelstrom. <laughs> Kill the current boss to save the previous boss. Think Dum Dum likes that and you can buy stuff from him afterwards. Did I do that? Hi, Crash. Maelstrom's pretty anti Haywood. True. Yeah, but that might have been because your game was fucking bugged. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to do. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens in the conversation. I'll see what speaks to me. What vibes? I'm gonna quick save. Stay cool. They're just trying to spook us. Oh, Easton, thank you for gifting five subs to the community. I really appreciate it. Don't you shine your lights on me. Who's up there? If you just got gifted a sub by Oisin, please enjoy your emotes. Feel free to slap people with your tentacles with consent. That's why they're called consentacles. Yeah, they're wanted for multiple homicides. 
<laughs> I don't think I have any non-lethal weapon. I have a katana machete. <laughs> Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Enjoy your sniper rifle. Get in the elevator, fucking sheep. <laughs> Fuck that guy. Hi. I feel like this is gonna go badly. Just stab him with the blunt end, duh. <laughs> Their turf. Uh huh. So what do you want? Hey, dum dum. Where's Royce? Here to see Royce. We got biz to transact. Mr. Royce is busy just now. You will deal with me. I'm <laughs> ready <laughs> until they get home and fall in half. Here for the flathead. You got a bot. Hey, the Lars. Model MT zero D one two called the flathead. And the hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Dum Dum. Love it. Now couch. Plan it. I love, I love it. Not Dum Dum. <sighs> this is fine. I'll stand. Look <laughs> at Jackie's face. It's so fucking hard. Fucking ass Jackie. On the fucking couch. Make me. Thought you'd never ask. Sit your ass down for a plan bullet you. Sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but. Oh, he shoves him out of the way. Shit. Well, all right. What's up? Come on. Up. No, thank you. What you blowing? Esky, pure as baby powder. That's not good. Black lace. Tough to get your hands on. Gotta have a good source. What's it do? Upstorfs an adrenaline to the point you feel no pain. Trip so intense it verges on psychosis. Hey, evil plots. Plot? Evil plot? Fighting legions during the corp wars. Cyber psychos pop the tabs like candy. Evil Vaporizing it mellows the burn without killing evil any Poland. of the effect. Come on, give it a whirl. I don't know. Yeah, you just give two subs. I'll pass. Thanks, I'm good. Dum Dum's like, fine, more for me. But yeah, you just give two subs. And then you'll get a code in your inbox. Whatever you say, straight-edged princess. Oh my god, he called me princess. <laughs> Here we go. Hey, Talon, how's it going? Model MT-0 D12. Took it, then he gave it to you afterwards? <laughs> Militech's not gonna come looking for it? Militech's not gonna come looking for it. Fuck him. They can hop around and try. We we'll removed the serial number and lifted access locks using our soft. What's yours? It's yours. Show it to me. Need to see it. Suit yourself. Music's doing really good to set the tone for tension right now. Fucking tricked out this thing. Thank Dynamic you for gifting yourself to Oris and Whoop. That made me jump. <laughs> cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Uh -oh. Down prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium. Dum Dum's a nerd. Composite. And watch this. Fully integrated link too. So when the spider starts crawling up walls, dangling from ceilings. There it goes. Mm -hmm. Could lose your lunch. Oh so God, Talon. It'll have to do. It'll have to do. Plan it cool, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. That's me. Let's see your cred. Brick got it. It's all paid out. Here we go. I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Really expect to pay me, me to pay twice? You fucking deaf! Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. Thank you for getting a submission. Who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice because I say you'll pay twice. Fine. You 
want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Prepared to offer us a discount? Seeing as you already got the eddies for it. You ought to offer us a discount. This a could get me one. killed. A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half of Pacifica? <laughs> he ain't dead. No. He's alive, well, and kicking. And he sends his regards. So, can you consider my offer now? Weapons. Okay, I don't care about that right now. Grab the gear. Skill shard, Shinobi. Hell, freaking yes. Cyberware capacity shard. All right. Well, I'll take that. Thank you. Button and controller. Let's go. Nope. Tonight, Yosa. Ricochet weapons allow you to control the direction, but uh, that's fine. I'm using a katana. I'm good. Thank you. I'm going to loot if you don't mind, Jackie. Oh, the sheer and utter panic. Oh, thank you for the prime sub. Welcome back. Happy two months. All right, we're going this way. I'm doing another quick save. We're locked in now. We're locked in now. Thanks for that, Meredith. <laughs> Pass through the maintenance tunnel. Okay. I mean, ultimately, it's the same situation, right? Cyrus Cola, it's Sarah's cola corn, and line. lemon. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really, no other way. Pass through the main install and turn on the production line to clear the passage. I'm just looting these. I'm not reading them right now. Anything I can do with this? messages urgent marketing issue mark i still have a problem with the direction of this ad it won't pass the focus groups with flying colors if at all yeah i did a hard save outside what do we hope to achieve by advertising milk i know you've seen the latest reports even if we jack up nutrient content and tweak the consistency we'd still lose to biotechnica's alternatives our paste products already test worse with younger consumers besides it's not even clear who the target audience is for this you are aware most of our target sales are in urban markets right unless you're playing off a sense of misplaced nostalgia or some reference i just don't get we need to seriously consider reassigning the marketing budget 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 <laughs> that's not even words from milk to something else do you have anything in mind from r d that's already been tested Lindsay, I'm not fully prepared to drop the milk project just yet. Despite your first impressions, we are act we've actually put quite a lot of thought into this campaign. Still, I'm willing to explore other options. We have the meat mixture based on insect proteins ready to go, the same we discussed last year, but weren't happy with the texture or smell. There's also a soluble powder based on mealworm larvae used as the base for porridges and soups. Main problem there is we'd have to start from scratch. Let me know if either of these options speaks to you and we'll sink on the topic later this week. Let's circle back to that. <laughs> Marked as urgent. Porno BD. Porno brain dance. Fuck BD. Sex brain dance. Porno hot BD. Max feel BD. Threesome fuck BD. Come explosion. Real feel fucks. <laughs> Do you crave more? They really went all out on the SEO. Looking for the hottest experience? Desire unlimited porn access? How do you know that name? It's from sex with like many X's. 
Desire unlimited porn access? Find it all here. F fire, fuck, skin melt, fuck yourself, BDSM, orgy fest, and so much more. <laughs> that was a very aggressive way to say cum explosion. <laughs> You're in all foods. Is this a fuckable meat BD? Yes! <laughs> Join now to see the hottest offers. Featured best of... Now, we had an argument about this because apparently the pronunciation of this is Marquis, not Marquis. Dishade? Didn't find what you're looking for? Fantasy so fucked up, it's not on our menu? No problem. Use our on-demand service to make an order. Our sex birds will do make sure your every desired comes true. The typos really make it. <laughs> Can we quote, is that Firefox skin melt a new browser? <laughs> yeah, did I not say Shadi? Sweet man, thank you for the biddies. We've got it all. Forever young. Are you in your 50s, 60s, even your 70s, but still want to look like you did in your teens? Do you crave the eternal youth of Arasaka's but can't afford the implants? We've got a solution. One a day... What? Will slow the effects of aging, helping you look even 20 years younger. You're just one small capsule a day away from... They can't do math. If you're in your 70s and it makes you look 20 years younger, you're not a teenager. You're just one small capsule away from enjoying your natural beauty to its fullest, even into old age. Exclamation mark, exclamation mark, exclamation mark. Puturn, put, I don't know what that is, is completely safe to use. Studies have shown it will be over, it's to be over 95% effective. Uh, incredible. I'm 68 years old and I don't look a day over 40. There's no spam filters in the future. One of our many satisfied customers. All my wife's friends constantly ask how she bagged her cougar self such a young husband. You should see her face when she tells them I'm actually old enough to be her father. Don't bother getting an expensive new faceplate. Invest in your stunning natural beauty. Need someone to watch your back? Okay, we're back at Danger Proyles Night City. I love them. All right, let's go. Uh, I think we're going up there. What's this? I see loot. Item components, let's hack and go. Puternamics. Puternamics? You're a puternamics. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Oh, good. It's moving. Let's go. Bye! Jackie! Jackie! He told me to hurry up. I got loot to do. Dance maca- Ooh, woo! Disinfectant. I don't know when I'm gonna need that, but. Oh, this is gonna be bad, isn't it? I just know it. This is a hostile area, Jackie. Jackie, someone sees me! Ow. Hang on, I need out. Jesus fucking Christ. Hold on. Hold the phone. Can I get out of here? Ow, I'm getting shot in the ass. Hold on. What am I, what, who's shooting me? That's not my gun. Is it? It really is. I thought my pistol had a sight. Holy shit, they take like no damage. Maybe I should just go for it. Watch out, Jackie. Fuck! Thanks for killing him. Music. Black and thank you for gifting us up to come explosion. I hate it here, no! You did not just do that. Why am I stuck? This is fine. Who is shooting me? Those are double doors. Whoa! Was I getting hacked? Smart weapon. Anything else? Oh, there's a guy up there. Run away! This is fine. Machete. All right, is there anything I can do here? Hey, Local network. Turn off the surveillance system. 
so they don't know where I am. Stop closing this door. Fuck. Oh, they don't know I'm here. They don't know I'm here. Jackie, be, be stealthy. Jackie, be stealthy. Uh, they are looking this way. Uh, can I get down there when they're not looking? I do think I'm quite clever. Oh no! <laughs> what a shame! What a shame. <laughs> oh hey! It's his head! <laughs> I cut it off! Oopsie! <laughs> Bargain! I require a sniper rifle, thanks. Fair. Thank you for the resub. Happy 14 months. Hey, 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 Hi, are you in a bit of a bind? Oh, shit, I know this fool. It's Brick. Oh, Brick, how'd you get in there? I mean, I'd like to help him, but I don't know how to help him. So, we'll find out. Talk about losing your head. Pick up a detonator. detonator. Armed. Huh. I don't know what it is, so I'm just gonna... Don't push the button! <laughs> I really wanted to push the button. Did it blow brick up? <laughs> is that what that does? Brick was not in one piece! <laughs> Stunning! All right, well, we need to find authorization to get him, but I think possibly you can hack it from one of the computers, but I don't think I'm good enough. I'm sorry to say. Did you have to run into me? I don't think I have enough skill. I cannot, in fact, hack the planet. <laughs> I don't think I can. Buddy, help me help you. Help me help you. Oh, wait, hang on. Maybe this? Messages. Marketing issue, marketing issue, penis nanogel, implants. Only you guys know. Brick's being demoted to cage duty. 9691. Keep it to your fucking selves. Okay. Uh, turn off the surveillance system. Wait, no, that's offline. There we go. 9691. Uh, nine. Oh, fuck. Not. Nah. Fuck! <laughs> nine, six, nine, one. God. So hey, what's up, Brick? How you doing? Been in here a while? A few days. Kind of lost count. Shh. Only Some they know better. Enough to care, slip me stuff, tried to help out. Royce threw him in the microwave dryer. Can't even Maybe cut. <laughs> this is kind of your fault we're here. Came for some tech deck spot. He tell you to free me? No. No, just to pick up the bot. Classic fucking decks. <laughs> Looking a little like we might have saved your skin. Jackie, you good? Think we'll do a favor, hombre. Jesus, slow down, maybe. I'll get you, but kind of caught me at a bad time. What was it? The fact that you were in we prison? Meet again. I know a microwave I'll dryer. Have you covered. <sighs> all right, escape from all foods. I mean, it's probably not a bad idea to have a maelstrom person who wants to help you out, right? Maybe Dum Dum will be nice to me. I don't think so, though. I think I fucked them over. What's happening down there? Also, how is my health? I feel like I might be in danger. Am I in danger? Who dis? Who are you? Code freak, maelstrom. Okay. I don't have enough RAM to do anything. Right, what's the situation here? We have a dude in that corner looking off to one side. There's a guy over here. I need to see Elysium. I've never watched it. Okay, hold the phone. This guy we could take. Oh, nope, never mind. There's another guy. Jackie! No! Okay. Oh shit, this is a lot worse than I thought it was. Never mind. 
I am getting fucking no open the door I'm getting hacked I don't have a lot of skill with this weapon but is somebody no Jackie oh my hell holy shit I'm in a bad place oh shit <laughs> Did he's your girlfriend? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, that was not good. Where was our last checkpoint? Let's not aggro all of the room. Let's not aggro the whole room. So anyway, I started blasting. So there are two there. Auspex, thank you so much for gifting two subs. Enjoy your sniper. I unfortunately do not have a sniper rifle right now. All right, so here's the sitch. Can I turn these off? Because I am worried. I need my RAM back. Yeah, I have no RAM. That one's still on. I don't think these cameras are turned off. Second time's the charm? We'll see. Right, that corner is kind of a dead zone. Oh, shit. Why can he see? Why is he there? Right, there are definitely two people down here. Ton of Moram, I should. I'm in so much danger. Overload's device is electrical circuitry, permanently destroying it. How does that help him then? Or help with him? What if I use it on him? I can reboot his optics with short circuit. I don't have enough RAM. I could distract them. Um, if you didn't get a pop-up for it, you can go to the drops page on Twitch and then scroll all the way down to the bottom. That's what Bar uh, Barry had to do. Oh, there's another guy right here. Oh, we are in so much danger. I'm not sure that this is going to go as well as I would like. I wonder if I can sneak past them. I don't think so. I think these two are gonna be a problem. Jackie! Jackie, Jackie! Stay still. Hell yeah! Made little evil happy, hell yeah. Right, I'm gonna try. So he's making me read. I'm gonna quick save here. Nope, that did not work. Run! Run, it's fine. I'm stuck on a box. We might have to do that again. Ouchie, 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 ouchie. Oh, there's so many of them. Holy shit. Why are there so many? Why are there so many? Time for payback, right? That's one down. Ow, malfunction. No, 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 no. Oh, I should not have run over here. This was bad. I'm taking damage over time. Fuck. Still blesses from Andre. Oh, do you remember that? <gasps> Unbelievable. Launch the game with Steam. That seems so weird. Whoops. <laughs> Playing on the hardest difficulty was perhaps not my smartest move. Wonder if I can get up there. Shut up, dude. There's gotta be a way to avoid. Oh my God, so many times. That time that we were trying to do that mission super stealthily and she was just like, I'm just gonna walk right here and start shooting. Jackie, why are you like this? Right, so I really wanna get over there, but I think these guys are a problem. So I'm gonna try distracting them. Shit. What was that? It's just a matter of time, motherfucker. 
shit. Okay, I can't get... I got him over there, but I cannot get his friend over there. There's three of them on that one light now. Come on, I'll be your friend! Oh, shit. They all went over there. But I think they're... I think that's going to be... What is he staring at? Ooh, no, okay. The guy really far away can see me. Oh, what's this? I'll pick it up. Why not try to distract him with grenades? I feel like I have to be a little bit more cautious with my uh, harder difficulty play. Is there anything I can do here? I can do... Oh, that. That might distract up top. It's not going to... Oops. Not going to distract here. Use the optic restart hacky, but it's only going to work on one of them. The problem is, as soon as I attack one of them, I attack all of them. <laughs> Someone did say to me that I was going to have a problem. Can I actually modify this at all? I don't think so. Do I have any... Nope, I have no sights. This is Dying Night. Let me see. Do I have anything... That's higher damage, lower attack speed. Higher effective range. A revolver. Run for us. I mean, I could run. <laughs> I could just run for the door. I also have a level up. So the door is on the opposite side. How hard do you think it would be to get out? I don't have to kill everybody. I just have to get across. I don't think you can actually do that. I just have to get across to there. What do you think's the worst that could happen? I'm gonna die. Go, 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 Run! Oh, shit. Is this a door? Fuck. Okay, well, where do I go? You need to die. There's a staircase. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, they, they're ruining my movement. Uh, bye. It's okay. It's fine. I got into the hallway. Oh, shit. There's more of them. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Don't you reboot my optics, you bastard! Where are they? Get in this doorway. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Look, I don't have to fight everybody. I just have to fight whoever is necessary to fight. You know, you know, you know? If you know, you know. Fuck off! Stop short-circuiting me! Can I do anything with this? Local network. Turn off the cameras. Just in case. Fuck! There's more people down there. I, I, don't worry. Don't worry about it. I got some, uh, my cola. Grenade! Run! Oh shit. Ooh, this is spicy. Jackie, you're kind of in the way, bestie. Could you stop hacking me? What do you mean weapon glitch? <laughs> uh, shit, it's fine. I'm gonna just shoot from up here, I think. Get short circuited, nerd. Ah, would you? Ow. Did he throw a grenade at me? Like the gunfire in the, yep, uh, right? Like that didn't, that didn't do anything, right? Him and his smart fucking weapon, hey? Shit. I am out of heals, so I'm just gonna retreat for a sec. We're good. This is fine. I like the recharging heals, actually. That's very cool. I ain't led for breakfast. <laughs> he ain't led for breakfast. Okay. No. 
This guy okay? <laughs> okay, uh, we're fine. Oh shit, I did not know there was somebody right there. Shit. No, I actually really don't like that weapon. This is fine, this is fine, this is fine, this is fine. Grenade! Did they die? No, they didn't die. Go get them. Okay, this is fine! <laughs> We're good, this is okay! All right. Whew. It's okay if we die a couple times. I just really wanted to play on a harder difficulty for the funsies. You can, you can deflect bullets. There's somebody done. Oh, it's a camera. Where's the camera? That's a cleaning machine. Oh, great. Oh shit. Oh, this is gonna be really shit. Why am I stuck here? Why can I not open the door? Oh no. Well. This could be a problem, Basties. Sneak past Roy is optional. Well, now that you've said that, I would like to sneak past Roy. Jackie, you be very fucking careful. I swear to God. If this guy comes over here, I'm fucked. Shit! <gasps> Shit! <laughs> Is there something I can distract them with? Like the car? Nope. Anything I can see? Shit. You didn't notice it? I've never stuck past him before. I've done two playthroughs. I'm pretty sure I fought him on both. I've never finished the game, by the way. Which I'm hoping I can change now. I really need to change where he is. But Royce is right there. Is there anything over there I can use to distract them? Shit, fuck, shit, fuck, shit. Okay, but he's moving. That might be enough. That might be enough. We can do it. Come on, Jackie. Come on, Jackie. We can do it. Come on, Jackie. I did it. Buzzing around everywhere. Ooh. What a rush. Yeah, it's that mill attack, bitch. I've never seen her here. <laughs> Bet you didn't expect to see me here. You nope. Know, I like the way you operate. Maybe you'd do some more work for us. I keep my word. When I say something, I do it. <laughs> Not on my other playthrough, I don't. Mm -hmm. Me too. Heard one of the flatheads is missing. Must have fallen off the truck along the way. Oh, sure did. Yes, Militech will never find it. Yes, mommy. Pleasure doing business. Secure mm -hmm. the area. You'd think they would come in now. We were on our way, mamita. You got it. Well, we did it. Holy shit, V. I wasn't sure we'd walk out in one piece. Nor was I. Good work, Jackie. Thanks, Jack. <laughs> Me next. Solid as ever. Hey, yeah, you too, but, uh, hey, what's this about? You feeling all right? Yeah, I want to make sure, you know, we're good together. I like how we do things. I do too, V. I love I Jackie so much. Hey. Let Dex know we got his toy for him. And then I say we hit the afterlife. <laughs> you know, do some shots. Do some shots, let's go. Hi luego, V. Okay. Call Dex. Okay. Ms. V, how about a little something to get those taste buds tingling? The biochip in question is in fact a so-called relic, a Nova tier piece of tech, catering to the top 1%, supposedly the best life insurance money can buy. You and I are going to be neck deep in Eddie's. <laughs> yeah, about that. Uh... Call. How things looking, Miss V? 
Got the flathead. Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what I mean, it worked, I... Sure. Bye, Jackie! Roy's gonna give in two shits that you and Brick had shaken on it. How'd you get him on board? You used the corporal? Yeah, we did. Met with Stout, managed to strike a deal. Well, well. Gave me the chip with the scratch for Maelstrom. One thing Stout forgot to mention. Chip was carrying forgot. a virus. Oldest corpo trick in the book. I assume Roy's was less than understanding. Uh -huh. Virus attacked their systems, scorched a handful of Maelstromers. I took care of the rest. You got some balls, Miss B. That's a guarantee. Everything's ready to roll, what night? We're all set. Ready to go. What now? Now we do the job I hired you to do. Grabbing that biochip. I'm excited. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Cool. Great. Be there in no time. See you, Miss V. Bye. Neato. All right, we leveled up again. That's cool. Head to the afterlife. Uh, which is quite far away. I need to level up. I was thinking I could probably fast travel. So, basically, the last time I did this, I cracked the chip and then paid with the chip with the malware not on it. And let's just say it wasn't Meredith Stout who met me here. <laughs> All right, I would like to level up three. Excellent. That means I can get these two, which gives me Scorpion Sting, 15% recover. Back. So I love this. 25% damage with knives, axes, and silent silenced guns outside of combat. I'm going to take that. What do these have? Quick getaway. Plus 10% movement speed after neutralizing an enemy while undetected. Duration 30 seconds or until you're detected. Stacks two times. New stacks reset duration. All stacks are removed when the duration ends. Gag order. Landing an attack on an enemy right after they detect you will delay detection from other nearby enemies? So if I like go up and throw... If I throw a knife or if I like stab them, it'll delay detection from everyone else. That's pretty neat. Um, I kind of want to take this, but I'm not going to take it yet. I am going to have a look at the reflexes tree again. So we have seeing double, increased damage and sun chance from counterattacks. And I'm going to take this one. Bullet time. Whenever time is slow, bullet deflect does not consume stamina and deflections automatically hit enemies for crit damage. That's pretty nice. Group takedowns. That's pretty neat. By that, do you mean you kill everyone, Cal? <laughs> All right. I love this stuff. Muscle memory, multitasker, allows you to shoot while sprinting. I'm not really shooting that much. Hi, Yuli! How are you? Um, so what does this do? Finisher Blade Runner. Um, unlocks a blade finisher. Press F when an enemy's health is low. Neat. Okay. I'm going to take... I think I should take dash and stuff. Mean streak, plus 40% stamina after neutralizing an enemy while dashing. Mad dash, extra range. Steady grip allows you to shoot while dashing. Can't touch this, 100% mitigation chance. Ooh, that's pretty nice. And then this one, flash and thunderclap. When performing strong attacks, you don't automatically leap to enemies. I think I would like to take this. So I'm going to take this. And then I have one... Do I have more skill... How many skill points do I have? I have one perk point left. So I think I'll take both of these. And then I think I can go this direction. It's pretty neat. I have one attribute point left. I will spend it in probably reflexes, to be honest. Kill Royce in the negotiation room so then he never gets to the power armor. That's cool. That is cool. All right, cool. We did it. Nice. Well, hey, how do we feel about Cyberpunk, friends? I'm enjoying it. I knew I would. I'd been playing it on YouTube. We have a fast travel to the afterlife, so I'm going to go ahead and fast travel there. So here's the deal. If you are not aware, there are drops in Cyberpunk right now. So if you watch a stream that has drops enabled, you'll get uh, an outfit. It's one piece per week. So this week is pants, next week is boots, and the week after is the jacket. Let's do a full save here. And then uh, if you gift two subs in my stream, it is not all stream streaming Cyberpunk. Uh, it's only people who are on, in the support of streamer campaign. So if you gift two subs in my channel or other participating channels, uh, you get the Yasha sniper rifle, which is exclusive. You can use it only in Phantom Liberty if you have the Phantom Liberty DLC. 
So if you gift two subs on my stream anytime between now and the end of October, I will give you a heads up that dis this uh, gift of subs are discounted from tomorrow onwards, but it's from tomorrow, like 5 p.m. my time. So after my stream. Game's pretty damn great. Looks amazing. Seems to play well. The audio is an absolute experience. It is. It's very overwhelming and a little overstimulating, but I think it works a lot with the um, with the vibe of the game, if that makes sense. It crashes your PC a lot. Oh, no, that's unfortunate. 20 year old PS. Yeah. A week that is pants. Seems legit. All right, friends. I'm going to finish up the stream here because we. this seems like a really good place to stop. But I will definitely be playing more of this this week. I'm trying to decide. I might play more tomorrow. Um, and we might do a bonus stream on Wednesday. But it's possible that what we'll do is... I'll, I'll decide, but I'll update you on Discord. Um, if you're not in Discord, it is open to everybody. Hi, Tix. I'm so sorry. Um, I'm thinking that we will play... So we're going to balance between this and Starfield because I'm still not done with Starfield. And I'm not going to be done with Starfield for a long time. Um, I'm thinking we'll do from now on until we're done, I guess. Monday and Friday, Cyberpunk, Tuesday and Thursday, Starfield. But I don't know what I'm going to do about that with regards to tomorrow because I know gifted subs are 25% off from tomorrow afternoon onwards. So it seems like it would be a shame to miss out on that for anybody who does want to get the uh, Yasha sniper rifle. So I'll figure it out, but I'll update you on Discord. But I am really enjoying this. I'm also going to do another save because I'm not sure how I feel. <laughs> But thank you, friend.